What's up, guys? How's it going, everybody? My name is Blatunger, and ladies and gentlemen, welcome on back to part number three of the gameplay walkthrough for Hogwarts Legacy. We're continuing onwards and forwards, proceeding in the main story. Once again, if you guys do enjoy the gameplay walkthrough, please don't forget to hit the thumbs up button. That would be very much appreciated. Subscribe if you haven't yet. Turn on your notifications. And with all that in mind, of course, also out of the way, character looks a little bit different because I did go on ahead and get some extra new clothing items and also did go on ahead and do a little bit of extra quests in between as i promised that i would but for now we're going to continue onwards and forwards it's going to be an epic epic one this time because we're going we're going we're going lengthy we're going lengthy with this part so we'll see how much we can get done hopefully it'll be quite a bit but first let's get some hellos out of the way cm how are you adam what's up doctor how are you darth raven how are you ace a or sorry al my bad uh, Smopsy? Is that how you say that? Spyro, Thomas Vu, Karam! Swag, how are you? Demon Slayer, how are you? What is up, Robbie? How's it going? Dolphin of Wisdom, how's your day? Thank you so very much for tuning in. Hello there, David A., how are you? Uh, NTG, what's up? Ace, thank you so very much for the kind words. Much, much, much! Uh, appreciate it. Thank you so very much for your support. Uh, hey, a question. So I have every single spell except, uh, every... Avra Kadavra, I think is what you meant to say. But for some reason, I cannot get this. Uh, well, I don't know, because it means you're actually further in the game than I am, Caleb. So uh, if anything, I'll probably be asking you for questions in terms of like how to unlock things or anything like that. So with all that in mind, let's rock and roll. We start in Hogsmeade and step one is going to be uh, taking us to the three broomsticks, I think, right? Yes. Hello. Why, hello there, Serona. Hello, Miss Ryan. I wanted to thank you again for your help Harry Potter Rookwood and Harlow the day of the troll attack. Serona, please. And I was happy to help. Oh, those two oh, are nothing but trouble. Water. Glad you and your friend were here when they found you. I am too. You were speaking to a goblin here that day. Yes, Lord God. He's a friend. Ah. Uh... How can you trust the goblin? I, I mean, they're not going to be all inherently evil. I've been here years. We met when I was waiting tables here as a student, well before I bought the place. He was cordial enough, but we weren't friends then. His mistrust of wizard kind ran deep. But you're friends now. We are. Robin, thank you so very much for being the first member. came in a few months ago. But he recognized me instantly, which is more than I can say for some of my own classmates. Took them a second to realize I was actually a witch, not a wizard. Not all goblins are like Ranrock and his loyalists. Lord Gok is as worried as the rest of us about what's been going on. In that case, I'd like to talk with him about Ranrock in particular. Where might I find him? I assume your interest is to do with the rumors I've heard about Ranrock working with our friend. That is correct. It is. Yeah, he's not here, friend. You might <laughs> find him doing business at the Hog's Head. He's a trusted metal trader. You should mention that we spoke. He can, understandably, be wary of witches and wizards. Even ones as young as you. That said, if you're looking for Rooster. information on Rooster. Ranrock to help rein him in, uh, find an ally in Lodgok. Robin, thank you so very much for your support. Thank you for becoming a member at the Corporal Rank. Thank you for being the first member of the stream. Much appreciated. Thank you for your support. Welcome, welcome to the Blitz Army. Salute from me to you. Um, What have you heard about Ranrock and... Rookwood. Have you heard what Ranrock and Rookwood are working on together? Not much more than the fact that they seem to have some sort of uneasy alliance. This is Friendship my favorite thing. Wizards and goblins is rare enough. I'll make but videos. Two, I'll get comments. Why don't you stream? Something I'll stream. I can Why do you only stream? Even it. though I do both things. Like there was a video today. Serpent. Both will need to be taken down to stop whatever scheme they've been plotting. You seemed unfazed by Rookwood and Harlow the other day. They don't scare you. They're bullies. Plain and simple. Never tolerated them in my own life, and certainly won't tolerate them going after my friends. Don't misunderstand me. They're dangerous wizards and shouldn't be trifled with. They should, however, be confronted and reminded, whenever possible, that the rest of us have each other's backs. Thank you, Serona. That's a pretty healthy attitude. Gog. Gotta be honest. Please. Give him my best. Will do. Okay, so the... Ooh, I got a helmet. Please. 
What's your this one? Okay. Sounds good. Thank you. All right. So, uh, we need to go look for Lotgok at Hog's Head Inn, which I guess is probably in Hogsmeade still. But let's get over there. Will you play the Kirby Dreamland Deluxe? Maybe. We'll see. Also, what's up? Hey, how's it going? Edith, hello. Thank you for tuning on in. What's your opinion on this game personally? I think it's okay. I've enjoyed it quite a bit so far. I think it's uh, quite well made. So we'll see. But, whoa. Um, again, this is the kind of game that you do have to play a lot of it before you can make like a full judgment call because it's, it's an open world game. So it's like maybe, you know, 12 hours in, I'll be like, you know what? This is getting like, which, I mean, I guess we're kind of 12 hours in at this point. But further down the line, it could get a little bit tedious but we'll see right so far i've enjoyed the first trial uh the ancient magic trials so Hello, we'll see what the other three are like sorona said i might find you here yes, she did did she did she send you with news no actually i wanted to speak with you it's about ranrock now i remember the three broomsticks day of the troll attack you're the student he's after i am and I need to know what he and his loyalists are up to, so I can stay a step ahead. Let's say I did know. Why should I trust you? Uh, well, I guess Serona trusts us, so... me, and she thought our interests may be aligned. Hmm. Well, if Serona trusts you, very well. I may know of something that could help us both. A way to get Ranrock to confide his plans to me. I'm listening. Hmm. Years ago, a heinous witch stole a sacred goblin relic. Rumor has it that it now rests in her sarcophagus, in a tomb accessible only by wizard kind. Ooh. Ranrock and I had a, a falling out a while back. The relic could well repair the chasm between us. Uh, I guess we'll retrieve the relic. Very well. I'll retrieve the relic. If Bring back the pajamas. This me. wizard cowboy fit is not it. Other. Maybe, maybe we'll change it up. Abscond with the relic, and you, that I'll share what I learn. Gather whatever. Yeah, it's unfortunate, you Robin. You you will have to wait a little while longer, but you know, um, it's it is. I actually had no idea that the game was going to be releasing on the other, like the previous gen consoles, uh, later down the line. So, um, that's uh, that was news to me that I found out on the last uh, part. Okay, so we need to go meet up with Lodgok near the Witch's Tomb, which doesn't seem all that far, so we should be able to get there quite weekly, you know? Oh, wait, I did say we would change things up a little bit, so let's see. I mean, I just don't think I have any cool new items yet to wear. So I don't know how much we can really, like, change up our look, per se. Um, Maybe this. Let's see, what kind of a robe? That's okay. This looks pretty cool now. Looks neat. Um, Ooh, look at that. Yo, this, this Bruce fit. This is definitely Bruce fit right there. You know, sheesh. Look at that. I'm out here looking like the fire. It rises. I'm ready. Good. There's no time to lose. Where's the fit? Let's run. Oh, he did. It will happen. It will happen. I'm working on it. Come to retrieve. I'm working on it. Valuable heirloom known as the Helmet of Erdgott. The witch considered herself a collector and purchased the helmet as a treasure. Is this a free roam game? Uh, yes. Yes, it is. It's um. That the rightful owner of it's an open world game. Its maker, not its so, wizard kind see things differently. So wonder goblins and wizards have ever been able to work together. The differences between our kinds are myriad. 
I missed they the part where that's my problem. It may surprise you the timing of that super chat. Those differences always to be uh, did you hear about the fire the at the circus? It was intense. Ha ha ha, very hilarious. That's a good one, sir. Really got us there. Just laughing like crazy. Oh my goodness, of course, Edith. Of course, Edith is going out. Spyro, do not entertain this, Spyro. Walk away from the comedy, Spyro. You know, just walk away from the comedy. You know what I mean? Yo, Iron Fist, can you chill out, bro? This is the only thing that you've been doing is, is uh, tuning in. I always say, this is none of my business. I go on ahead and let people discuss what they want to discuss. You saying this, like, it's... I, I don't understand what you're trying to do. You're just trying to, like, agitate the conversation. Like, I, I, I don't quite understand what um, the, the goal there is. Um Like you are more than free to express your opinion, but this is not the place. I always say, I play video games, that's all I do, right? So Uh Andrew, I was sent a code by Warner Bros. This is the first time I've used the member chat function. I uh, figured I might as well use it to support a fellow Canadian. Thank you. Uh, yeah, so Robin, uh, I don't know if you know, by becoming a member, you actually have um, emotes that are available to you as well. You know what I'm saying? Can you get a fade in this? Like a haircut fade? Yeah. You can uh, stylize your characters here. Ah, and there it is. The witch's tomb. Dreadful looking place, isn't it? Whoa. Looks like we're going to need to do some puzzling work here. Okay, let me get that. Uh, uh, uh. Uh, we got a flu flame. I wish you luck retrieving the helmet. As a wand carrier, you should have an advantage. Now, before you set off, do you have any questions? Ah, uh, so why exactly is this helmet all that valuable? Helmet makes it so yeah. special. Hopefully, we'll actually get to wear the helmet. That'd be wildly cool. Relic, forged during a uh, Jedi gamer, what's up, man? How you doing? It inspired greatness. That is until it was no longer ours then it became something else a symbol of what has been lost of all that wizard kind has taken from us reclaiming it would mean a great deal to goblin kind and to ranrock he would be grateful to me should i return it mm, okay interesting uh what might we encounter in this tomb? Idea what could be waiting for me when did I get gifted a member? That was most likely yesterday, Roma. Uh, that was the absolute mad lad. Adam Hill came through with 50 gifted memberships yesterday. So there's a lot of people who did not have memberships that now do. Um, so if you see him in the chat, if you could take a moment and thank him, that would be uh, very, very uh, cool of you to do. And just simply good manners. conspiring. Why would that be? I had heard this. When the dark-hearted conspire, they seldom make their full intentions clear to one another. Mm. I can only speculate. So I guess it's just a convenient where they're each using one another child. for their own uh, goal, you know? So. It all seems clear to me now that we're here. I do hope our alliance proves fruitful. Again, I wish you luck. I was just asking because I want to know how to get my code. Well, did you buy the game uh declan thank you so much for the uh member super chat thank you for the continued support 25 months from declan sheesh saying hey blitz how are you i am doing absolutely wonderful how are you uh what's up chris evans yesterday was pretty crazy i agree that was the most amount of members ever in the history of the channel 
uh, in one day. So excited to finally get my hands on the game tomorrow. Nice. Uh, well, enjoy it. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. Enjoy it. You know? Okay. So let's head on down into the tombs. Whoa, that freaked me out. I didn't expect the torches to come on like that. You know what? We could Lumos. probably cast Lumos to be able to see a little better. It's sealed. Hmm. I probably should not. Wait, do I just cast Lumos again? Yep. Oh, we got some Quidditch gloves. Ah, uh, not all that interested in that, to be honest. Okay. Um. Can we get rid of the webs there? I guess not. Ooh, what's this? Merlin's beard. A Merlin's beard. Okay, things are starting to split up here. Things are gonna get spicy. A new nightcap. Probably should go back to Lumos. Just so everything is nice and bright. Less likely to miss out on collectibles in that this case. This can't be the witch's tomb. Likely I need to go further. Don't need to repair? Okay, so then maybe just sort of push her. That works. Blast our way through. Okay, so we need to find three butterflies. Uh, you my butterfly. You know that song? Uh, yo, Kathleen, uh, thank you so very much for the 199 super chat. Much, much, much appreciated. Thank you, thank you, thank you for the support. What did this person say? Oh, you absolute turd. If you spoiled this for me. Oh, I should not have clicked the show message. Dang it. Lumos. That's a turd move, bro. That is turd-like behavior. F's in chat. All right. The door shall... See that? That's like, let's be honest. All of us have at some point in our life, right? done the thing where you walk up to like the grocery store and the you do this with your hand to open the doors or like the elevator door like i'm not the only one that's done that right i have a feeling i'm not alone here lumos oh boy zombies those things look kind of like the monsters from moon knight Doctor, thank you so very much for the uh, um, member chat. I'm going to read that in one sec. I'm built different. I mean, that was pretty crazy, huh? I played that like an absolute boss. Yo, what's up, Blitz? Been a little while. How you doing, bro? Also, just curious to know, what's your favorite comic? My personal favorite is The Sandman. Favorite comic? It's too difficult to just pick one. Um, I really, really always uh, love the um, If This if this Be My Destiny uh, storyline, the three issues for Spider-Man, Amazing Spider-Man, just because I think, like, there's never been a more, like, concise, well-told story uh, for Spidey. So I like that. Um, I like Scott Snyder and Greg Capullo's run on Batman. Um, or at least like the first 30 issues or so. Sandman is good. Invincible is really good. Um, I don't know. It's too difficult to just pick one, you know? Okay, we're going to go attach this mm. butterfly here. If mm -hmm. I could power it somehow, it looks like it could be rotated. Oh. Hmm. 
Am I supposed to grab that one up there? No. Um. Thank you. Big brain blitz out here solving puzzles like an absolute sauce boss. What else is new? Wait, did we grab the butter? LD Badger, thank you so very much for the night. LD Badger, holy moly. 19 months of being a Blitz Army member at the Capitan rank. Hey, Pav, uh, what has been your favorite part of the game so far? Um, I just think the world building, like attention to detail has been astounding. Um, I think the world building is probably the thing that has impressed me the most in terms of just the, the, they do such a great job of like, making this feel like a real place um because they pay attention to so many minute little details it really really like works super duper well because of that you know um i don't even have to go this way. super chat your flames you absolute mad lad you Thank you so very much for the tactical super chat coming through. Watch out for your ears. Uh, biggest super chat of the stream. Remember me from yesterday. Yes, I do remember you. from Was it yesterday, though? Wasn't it two days ago? You were here for the last... Uh, the last uh, stream, no? The last uh, Hogwarts stream. How do I push that over there? Your ears just barked. I'm sorry. My apologies. I don't know how to get these things over here because I know they're supposed to go over here. But I can't get them to like fly forwards. Maybe if I just push it. No, 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 no. Where are you going? Please. There we go. Now I have to grab the other. There we go. So basically the skeleton bones, you have to get them onto the, uh, the, 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 the spine and then it spawns in every, all the pieces. You know what I'm saying? He was here for the Fortnite stream. Oh, really? Okay. Then I uh, I stand corrected. My apologies. Uh, welcome back, Flames Plays Fortnite. Thank you so very much for tuning on in. I guess I should have known by the name, huh? It's not Flames Plays Hogwarts Legacy. So that was my What's bad. What's that hanging there? Looks precarious. Precarious. Mm. Okay, so I'm gonna have to figure out a way. To get around. It's sealed shut from the other side. Can we just maybe down I go. No other way. Okay. First let's just get some extra loot. Nothing there, nothing there. I'll get this at least before we keep going. Oh no. I won't get it. Am I supposed to bring that platform with me down there? Like, drop it down? Chest. It's over there. Iron Man 3 will be 10 years old. You feel old? <laughs> um, sure. Yeah. It's, uh, listen, time flies. That's for sure. We were just talking about this not that long ago. Like, think about the fact that, guys, we're already 10 days into the second month of the year. Like, I feel like I just celebrated New Year's, and we're already 10 days into the second month. Can we grab this with us? Wahoo! Oh, it's water. Wait, where the heck did the crate go? Okay, this looks like a boss fight area. Maybe not. Lumos. Oh boy. 
Bro, back up! Back up! Hit him, hit him, hit him! Don't celebrate too early! Got him. I gotta be honest, the, the spell combat in this is fantastic. Like it, it really is fun to just string all the moves together. It's it's an absolute blast. They're making another Toy Story thoughts. Um I, I don't know, like to me, it's we were talking about this last night. Um Lumos. when we found out the news, but to me it's like it's not very like Pixar esque, um, but I guess we'll see. You know what I mean? Like, it, ultimately, at the end of the day, it all comes down to will they do a good or a bad job with it, right? No matter what, like, no matter how much I might be able to say, like, hey, I don't think it's great or whatever, um, or I don't think it's like the best thing for them to do. Um, we still have to wait and Practical super chat, bro, flames. Um, Flames, thank you so very much for the uh, second tactical super chat of the stream. Uh, once again, the biggest super chat of the stream. Much, much, much appreciated. Thank you very much for your support. Let's get some tactical super chats in the chat. Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for your support. Coming through with the godlike. Okay. Uh, thank you for the uh, support. She says, Yay. Uh, what is your favorite Batman? It can be from shows, comics, games, movies. Um, animated series, Arkham, and Christian Bale. So those would be the three. Uh, movies, Christian Bale, Batman. Uh, sh uh, animated series, Kevin Conroy. And I guess Kevin Conroy and Arkham uh, as well. So I'll go with those three as my personal favorites. Uh, how are we supposed to bring the... Hmm. Where are we supposed to bring, I guess? Uh, oh, this is where we're supposed to bring them. Lumos. Do, do, do. Uh, Chris, thank you so very much for the support. Like always, broski, older you get, the faster time flies. As Jeremy explained, when you're 10, one year is one tenth of your life. When you're 50, one year is only one fiftieth of your life. Yeah, that is uh, as crazy as it is. Lumos. Uh, it sounds super simple, but you are 100% correct. It really is true. I'm a little confused, though. How can I get the... Oh, I know how. I was supposed to probably go all the way around, right? You're 100% right about that, Chris Evans. You are 100% correct. I agree with that. A 100 uh, percentile. Do, do, do. I was probably supposed to go through here, right? Lumos. Let me the chest. Uh, what is your favorite Marvel hero? Spider-Man. Lumos. Okay, so I was wrong. Um, how the heck am I supposed to get... Because if I drop down, like, there's no way for me to cast Lumos and... Can I make this jump while... 
No. What the heck? Is there like a... Oh, wait. I think I have a spell that's like stasis, right? Or something like that. No, that's Glacius. Uh, Accelerus. Hmm. Maybe I don't have... Oh, wait, 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 wait. There it is. Uh, let's equip that. Yo, Bass! Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Blitz Army! Thank you so very much for the salute. Much... Or, sorry. Thank you so very much for the salute. Thank you so very much for the support. Oh, my goodness. Bruh. Salute from me to you. Welcome, welcome, welcome to the Blitz Army. It is very much appreciated. Uh, welcome to the ranks. Thank you, thank you, thank you for the support. Second member of the stream. We are two-tenths of the way there. Uh... Are we going to get another trailer for Spider-Man uh, 2? Probably. Um, I don't know if it'll be in the next showcase because I still think the next showcase that PlayStation does will most likely, if I had to guess, uh, would most likely end up being... Um... Oh, wait. I forgot to kind of jump onto it. Uh, will most likely end up being... Um... Did I change the spell? Oh, there it is. Okay, so let's just test that out. Well, that didn't work. So what the heck? How are you supposed to do that? I can get across. I need to bring moths to the door. I understand that. How? Because even if I get Luke. this, like, I can't hold on to this and cast this, right? Yeah. What the heck just broke? I know how to do it. I know how to do it. I know how to do it. Lumos. Reparo. No! Why Reparo? Don't Reparo! Okay, 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 okay. I think I figured it out. I think I've got a plan now. We'll get, uh, we'll go, we'll go across. Like this. Grab this. Wait, where's the butterfly? What the heck happened? Lumos. Is... Is that it up there? Oh, there. Okay. We'll take it. And then I think the last one's here, right? I kind of figured it out. Uh, Flames! Uh, please, please, please. Like, you've been extremely generous. I appreciate the support. Thank you, thank you, thank you. Much appreciated. Thank you. You're all good, though. Please, don't go out of, like, uh, uh, out of your way. Uh, with the super chats and all that. Don't go crazy, please. Wait, actually, I can't do this the way that I thought. Because I thought if I go with this over here, then I go up, but I can't. And as soon as I let go, it's going to fly back over there. Hmm. What if I... I never tried this. What if I just did this? Lumos. Oh, it doesn't do that. I was hoping that maybe by removing the thing, it would like stop it. How would we, how would we get there? Chat, I'm gonna need help trying to figure this one out. I'm gonna need, uh, yeah, that's not gonna work. Where does it get sent to when I pass the pulse up? Did it get sent up there? I guess we'll see. Let's check this out. Use the pause time thingy. Oh, on the actual spinner. You're right. I was using it on the rock, but I probably do use it on this, right? Who said that? Gabriel, you genius. Or kind of genius. I mean, still kind of genius because... At least now I have a, a plan of how we can do this. 
That works. That's actually smart. Get up here. Lumos. I still don't know where the the butterfly flew to though. Is it here? Or am I supposed to go get that one? But how would I be able to? Because I can't even spin that thing if I. If we get it halfway up. That's no good. I think I might have just. No. Okay, there it is. Okay. So. I hit this thing with the spin. Bro, I don't understand why this is so confusing. If I spin it, pause it, climb, but I can't climb when I'm holding on to the butterfly. Because, look, if I spin it, then I go pause, right? Quickly run over here. Grab this thing. Run, 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 run. Repair. I, I. It doesn't work. Hmm. Lumos. Like, I can move the pieces, like, closer, like this. It's just... This is infuriating. Freeze it and grab it from up top. No, but I have to grab this. Because this is the one that I need to bring. Lumos. Right? Like, the only one that I need to bring is this. Well, either this one or the one that's in there. Wait, are there two in there already? Surely that's not true. Is it? No, it's just one. Yeah, because, like, this thing wouldn't work without it. So I have to have one butterfly there to spin, right? But at this height, like, the only way I could climb it is if I have... Can I push the butterfly up to the other platform? Lumos. Like, if I take this, then I go to this. Can I get it up there? Uh, Like, up there? Did it go over there or no? It sure did. Oh my goodness. Maybe free freeze what? Like freeze are you talking about this? Like freeze the butterfly itself? Lumos. Arrest momentum. This is infuriating. Incendio? Um I don't think uh, there's nothing really that Incendio would help help with here. You know? Like, if I could get one of the butterflies over here, we're good. But that's the problem, is trying to get them over here. Lumos. Let me see. Maybe I if maybe if I could get it up there, right? Where did it go? It just goes back here, like... Ah! It's not the pulse, so... What, what other spells do I have? I have light. Disillusionment, which is not really what we need here. I do have the pull ability. C can I call the butterfly over by just using pull or no? Nope. 
Need a butterfly kill count on the screen? That's uh, th that would be inappropriate. <laughs> to just be all the butterflies have been wiped out of existence. Um, use the pulse on the spinner, then immediately use the time freeze, grab the month, and book it. But if I, if I, okay, so like watch. This is what I I've tried to do that before, right? But here's the issue, right? So to me, if I go on ahead and go over here, right? If I place this here, and then I go on ahead and run over to here, and I spin, freeze, run. It raises that pillar as well? Holy moly, I legit had no idea. I legit had no idea. Okay, now we freeze it and we go grab it on that side. That's why it wasn't working. Freeze, run. Lumos. Hold up, please. Why is that not? So am I too far away? Or do I need maybe to like cast Lumos? It's possible, I suppose. Is that what I'm supposed to do? You know? Maybe. Maybe we'll do that. Let's do that instead. Arresto, momentum. Arresto go here. Lumos. What? It worked! Why did it cancel? Oh my goodness. Okay, spin again. Freeze, run. Lumos. Got it. Freaking finally. Wait, where's the... Oh. Bro, I was about to say, I'm like, if this doesn't work, this would be a very weird, you know? The witch's final resting place. Oy, oy, oy. Lord Gok said the helmet was in the house of Kofi. Lumos. Arresto momentum. All right, we're going to collect this. A dead Ashwinder. Mm -hmm. Your compatriots must have made to show this to Lodgok. This. There must be some sort of mechanism for this doorway. Uh, that's the mechanism. Just walk up to it. Pretty simple. Ba -da -ba -ba -ba. <laughs> okay. I guess we just talked. Lord Gok, the sarcophagus had been raided. I found no helmet, only a dead Ashwinder. Damn, they got here first. We need to get it before Rookwood uses it to further ingratiate himself to Ranrock. I saw one of their campsites not far from here, but I fear you must go in alone. My fighting days are behind me. Hmm, very well. I'll head there now. Good, there's no time to lose. Get to that helmet before Rookwood does, or we will lose our chance at any leverage, no matter how small, with Ranrock. Sounds good. Have their hands on such a relic. We can speed boost. He's just making you do all the dirty work? Uh, possibly, but... The deal is the deal. Held your own. Now have a chance. Lightning strike. Cost us our ransom. 
Black. Back it up, baby. Got him. Got him. Let's go. Okay, let's go. Got one. What have you done? Let me also. Got him. Whoo! Oh, one less poacher in the wizarding world. That's it. This is for Rookwood. An Ashwinder assassin. Okay. Love you so. Adam. Got him. Okay. That's a lot of enemies. Uh, did you see that Bob Iger is willing to sell Hulu? Um, I didn't get a chance to read like the full context. I saw like the little blurb about it, but um, yeah, I mean that makes sense. You know what I mean? It makes sense because they need ways to uh get some more cash flow going. So it's a logical step. I retrieved the helmet from the Ashwinders. Well done. This is sure to impress Ranrock. The helmet shines even more brightly than I imagined. The etchings, the contour of the profile, remarkable. It looks stunning, Rodgok. I see why you wanted it back. You did the thieves a service by recovering it. I know many a goblin who would have killed for it. Ah. Then I'm glad to be rid of it myself. Thank you. This should earn Ranrock's trust. I will take it to him immediately. It may distract him from his search. His search? It, uh, it is merely an inkling. You have impressed me greatly, friend. I am glad that I trusted you. If I use we my Discord Nitro soon. boost on the server, would Best you animate the Discord logo? Quiet for now. Many will not believe that our aims might possibly be aligned. The Discord logo. What Discord logo? Hey, so we got the helmet, I think. Let me see. Let me see. Let me see. Like my logo or the logo of the server? What are you talking about? What you talking about? Dun, dun, dun. No, no, nothing is better. We're going to just sell all that stuff off. Sell all that stuff off. We need to describe describe that one so we could figure out what's that item all about okay um so hmm where would oh maybe it's a, an appearance i always forget that there's appearances there we go oh yeah oh yeah okay looking pretty stylish i could go back to the suit of armor uh nope it's over here but we could rock this look. Just show up like this. Is this the way? This is the way. Put on the, the, the mask as well. Show up like this. <laughs> I like that armor. We would be looking pretty stylish. Okay. 
So, with that being done, I think we're good with that quest. Uh, did not hit level 23, unfortunately. So, we're going to bring up a map and proceed from there. Uh, you can have the server icon become animated on the server. Um, maybe? I don't know. Like, honestly, I have no idea. Um, I would... The only thing I could tell you is would be I would look into it, but I don't know for sure because I barely, 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 barely know how to use Discord. What if you could dress up as a mushroom? You um, how I suppose I would not be surprised by that, considering there's so many different outfits in this game. I invented flu powder. Doo -doo. Looking like Shredder? A little bit, a little bit. We just need the arm uh, gauntlet. That would be pretty sick. You know? Okay, here's the... Gladwin Moon. Hello again, Mr. Moon. Oh, I was hoping to see you again, my young friend. Uh, Gladwin Moon, Hogwarts camp. Uh, Spidey, I think this game is super ginormous. First, uh, like, I think if you're going to try to 100% complete, uh, complete it, it's going to be, like, a giant, giant game. You know? I had a rather disconcerting encounter although i hear your visit to hogsmeade was even more eventful than mine that's I true call it eventful i certainly wasn't expecting a troll attack oh of course not um, if Ant-Man 3 does good in the box office can bring there. the stock in fact the stock of disney to go to up i don't know possibly to bump into you it depends you it, there's so many different variables right one project by itself very rarely will have a massive influence up or down. We finally learn how to get rid of uh, the loot that that statue holds on to. Ta-da! Now, if you wouldn't mind humoring me for a moment, a demiguise moon. Okay. What do we use those for? Odd little contraptions, aren't they? It seems the statue vanishes once the moon is removed, which incidentally can only be done at night. Uh, why don't you hold on to that one for now and I'll explain more as we walk. Uh, ever since that fateful day in the village, those curious statues have begun appearing about the castle. Okay. Their number have been strewn around Hogsmeade. Someone, it seems, is trying to torment me. You see, hmm. that day in Hogsmeade, I turned a corner and came face to face with a boggart. Or, or shapes. Oh, you're thinking of making this the first Which game that you 100% complete? Good luck. There's a lot to do here. This one took the form. It's definitely going to be um, a pretty challenging one, I feel like, to fully complete. Like all the costumes and all that stuff. Because there's a ton. Holy unnerving. I encountered one when I was a lad in Korea. I know for a fact I'm gonna be 100% completing it. Okay, guys. Good luck. Good luck. It's gonna be. It's because. I mean, I guess technically there is a way to check if you're 100% completing. Because if you go into collections, I think it gives you percentages. Like, never mind. It doesn't. But it gives you a way still numerically to follow along, so you can kind of know which things you've done, which one, which things you haven't. But like, imagine you have to do all of that and then all of this. Which, like, as much as I've played, which is probably close to 20 hours at this point, like, quests are only 37% done. Combat, only 24% done. Exploration, literally 11% done. So, like, there's a lot uh, to go and a lot to do. So, e it'll take a while uh, to get all that done for sure. Do, 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 do. Some jackanapes use the bogger to learn my greatest fear and use it against me. Uh, yeah, I'll probably do a discussion for Quantum Mania. Sebi? Oh, are we about to learn how to finally open locks? That they will slip up and reveal themselves as the statues disappear. Mm. That is why I need your help in removing the statues. Why me? A couple of reasons, frankly. Uh, first, your daring do against those trolls in Oxmead has gained you a reputation for fearlessness. Second, as macabre and hideous as a demiguise is, most would find my fear of them unwarranted. 
You, however, have seen how they affect me. I'm at my wit's end, young friend. I simply can't bring myself to go near them. In fact, I know of two statues right here in the faculty tower. Perhaps you could start simply by removing them, so uh, I can go about my evening duties. <laughs> okay, well, I guess we, we might as well help. Glad to help you, Mr. Moon. Oh, I knew I could count on you. Uh, first, you know how to cast a disillusionment charm, correct? Mm. Yeah, I don't know anyone that's 100% completed the game. Uh, next, there's so much, right? And at best, However, you've had the game for like, what, three days? Two days? Alahamora. That's out. But what about curfew? Curfew? Oh, tosh. I sense you're a bit like me when I was your age. Oh, the school was my oyster. <laughs> and I took advantage of it. Oh, everyone loved me for it. <laughs> oh, those were the days. Uh, now, you'll find one statue in the prefect's bathroom and the other in the hospital wing. Good luck. Oh, and thank you. No worries. We got you. Learned a new spell. Brushed it. So there we go. We got Aloha Mora. Um, let me think. I guess we'll equip it to this page. Uh, where is it? Did it not pop up yet? Oh, cool. You don't have to actually cast it as a... Bell. What the heck is happening? Use the left stick and right stick to move the sparks and rotate the dials until both corresponding gears are activated to release the lock. Okay. I'm not even sure if I did that correctly. But all good. Okay. No, no, no. Unlock. Use the unlock. Aloha, Mora. I'm so confused as to how are you supposed to even do this? Am I controlling the little thing or the... Are you trying to like oh oh what what lines am i trying to line up Did we go all the way back Oh, is it this? Like, line this up with that. Oh, oh, oh. Why did I just do that? The, the green light appeared over there for a second. Holy moly. I literally don't understand the, 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 the structure here. You know? Okay, so you have these two bits. So the red controls the small one. I can go up, down, left, or right, and then rotate. And the left stick controls... This is so confusing. Am I just supposed to line all of them up? Like that? No, that can't be it. How was this small circle moving earlier? There. Okay, I literally have no idea. 
Captain America sliding puzzle. I just don't know. I don't understand the, the what the Hello. the mechanic is. That's the problem. Because I understand that this moves this. Something makes this thing like tick and go around. But you have to twist each one until it clicks. Okay, so I think that's the right one. Holy moly, okay, got it. So you literally just slowly push around um the the circle and then when it clicks then you're good got it that actually makes sense casting <laughs> revelio reveals 30 figures okay cool revelio there's one. Another le uh, letter there. Revenue. Oh, so there's different levels of locks. Okay. The, the lock mechanic might be the first thing that I'm like... Rather poorly, I'd say. Is that... We're raising a generation of coddled cape flappers that can scarcely tell the difference between Arcanite and Asphodel. Yes, well, it's still early. Perhaps they'll improve. You say that every year. Ooh! I don't know if we're supposed to go... All the way up? I guess we'll see. For now, just book it up. Okay, so this enemy should not be able to see me no matter what. So we're good there. We'll use Lavioso on this thing. Lavioso. Why doesn't that person just go that way? Revenio. This must be the prefect's bathroom, Alohomora. Okay, so just go slowly. One, two, three. Just kind of nice and slow. Whoa. I think I got it. Woo! Just a ga uh, ghostly suit of armor moving around? Yes, basically. Uh, Darius, thank you for the two. Uh, what's up? Later, can we play Fortnite? If not, uh, no, I'm not gonna be playing Fortnite today. Fortnite was yesterday's stream. Alohomora. Oh my goodness! Just pay attention. Once those pieces, yep. Once those are rotating. Okay, never mind. I feel like now, now I've got it. You know, now I've figured it out. Now to, uh, uh, I'm coming around on the mechanic. I thought it wasn't good, but it's actually pretty easy to use, so. Um. <sighs> oh, boy. What does this do? Revelio. Can simply go anywhere uninvited. Uh oh. 
Okay, so we can't. We can't go on ahead and just um, uh, reactivate. Uh, someone renewed their membership? Really? Who? Uh, are you talking about Bubble Nugget? Bubble Nugget? If I didn't shout you out, I think I... Oh, maybe I didn't. I, I think I might have just read your message, but I didn't actually give you a shout out. Sorry. Uh, welcome back to the Blitz Army. You have to twist each one slowly until it clicks. That is correct. That is correct. So I don't really understand what the water things do. Like, are you supposed to use those as like a distraction almost? So like you twist one of them and then that allows you to go on ahead and... Um, keep going. You know what I'm saying? Okay, so now we have to figure out how to get to the hospital wing. This is another level three lock. Oh, holy bro. Uh, Darius, thank you for the two. Uh, sorry for spamming yesterday. All good, all good. Uh, again, some people don't know not to spam, so. Mm -hmm. I guess we just have to get past this. Why is... There we go. Wait, is it still there? That had better not be enough. You are to be remanded at once. Oh my goodness. Okay, so, th so this... This is where the game is starting to get... I, I swear, I really have found the game more challenging on the puzzle end than on the combat end. Like, everything combat-wise has been pretty chill. Like, not too, too challenging, really. Uh, but boy, oh boy. Okay, so let's try to get. We can get the distraction and we can just book it. Blue flame? It gives us another page. More field guide pages. A unicorn fountain. How lovely. Okay, so. I mean, I guess we could just kind of try to just go for it, no? Wait, where did the page go? Whoa, 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 whoa. Where the heck did the page go? Oh. Fuck you. Probably not the best idea to be trying to get field guide pages. I thought I heard something. You didn't. Perhaps not. Anyway, I had high hopes for Hufflepuff. I was finally going to learn the Quidditch. Ta da! I did it. I did it. Ta da! Can we get this? Oh, no, no, no. The golden switch. Rather a lot like life, isn't it? Oh, I suppose I should pay closer attention at the next match, if there ever is one. I suppose you should. Okay, we're good. I think we just go back. Oh, wait. Dang it. We need this wizard to look oh no holy moly i hit the railing by mistake there that was almost a disaster but we're good all is well that ends well um i think we can just probably slip by here careful uh was this the level that we started at? We got a puzzle. Let's let's do this puzzle real quick. 
let's do this puzzle i did take a picture of the uh puzzle screen to make sure that i always have the numerical values in front of me okay so the spider is worth eight um okay so that's gonna be um do we need a zero i guess there right so that's the first question mark so zero is the owl uh and then for this one it's gonna be three plus whatever creature that is it's like a goat uh two so that's so then we need nine nine is like the hydra with a bunch of heads so there it is and now the puzzle door should open chest found don't know what we need the unicorn statue for Continue to get loot, but nothing really better value than what we have, which is unfortunate. It'd be nice to obviously get like a epic rarity item. Yeah, 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 yeah. Cast the Hopefully that makes it look that way. Then we can sneak by. We're good. We are a okay. Here we go. Hello, Holy moly, bro. These the stealth missions are more difficult oh, than Arkham. Yours, fearless, as I'd hoped. You know? Excellent start. If we can collect more, it may shed some light on who's behind all this. Of course, I first suspected Peeves. He drove the previous caretaker, rancorous carp, to an early retirement with his intolerable buffoonery. But that does not explain the bogger in Oxmead, does it? No. I am determined, with your help, to discover the identity of my tormentor. Okay, well, I guess we're going to have to help you with that, too. I'd like to help you solve this mystery. Uh, you, my friend, are a gentle person and a, a scholar. And I have something to offer in exchange for your assistance. Now, remember, the moons are only retrievable at night. Thus, I encourage you to use a disillusionment when necessary. Okay. Uh, how many statues are there in total? How many statues are there to find? I don't know precisely, but I've spotted dozens. Oh my goodness. So have I. So we're going to have to find a lot of them. If you were to ever unravel their meaning. Got it. Okay. Uh, what will we get in return? Something in exchange for my assistance. I did. No, I don't think anything comes close to those Arkham stealth machines. No, I'm talking about difficulty, not like quality right not every lock is as easy to pick as the faculty towers okay understood i shall keep an eye out i appreciate that so i guess as we unlock more statues he's going to give us an upgraded version of uh aloha mora which lets you open up more and more higher rarity uh or higher difficulty locks quest completed the caretaker's lunar lament brilliant Let's open up our quest log. Um, so I think I'm going to pivot to side quests now. Um, yeah, why not? Let's do this one. Let's go find. I didn't get any better loot, right? Dude, we got four different hats and none of them are better than the one we have. That's an L. L to bah H. Okay. Hello, friend. I wonder if you might stop by the three broomsticks Sona. when you can. I would like your Over. help something. Uh, that's probably a side quest, though. My sister around Mrs. Hogwarts, and she hasn't been herself lately. I'd like to take you up on your promise to visit her with me. I'm heading to Feldcroft soon, so I'll let you know. It's just south of Hogwarts, by the way. Okay, Sebastian. I hope you're faring well with the blasting curse. It's still one of my favorites. Boom, boom, boom. Um, now that you've attended Beast's class, I've asked Deke to assist you in using the room to further your studies in that regard. Please meet him there when you can. Okay, let's go. Holy moly, how many side quests am I getting? I've been beside myself with worry. Could you meet me in the courtyard? Sure. This is why I said 100% completing this is going to be overwhelming. Like, there's just so much to do. 
Hence why I'm going to do a little bit of side quests in terms of getting the spells unlocked because I feel like that's super important. Being able to just have the ability to um, cast all the different spells is obviously going to be super useful. But I'm not too concerned about getting every um, Have you finished your assignment? quest completed. At least not on I the first the run, task, you know? Professor. Well, well. Have you ever played I sticks? No, I don't know what that is. Efforts. After all, shortcuts only ever lead to Galaxy, shortcomings. you're all good. Um, yeah, I mean, I, I guess like for some people, it would be actually really nice because you have so much to do, so you don't feel like you have to, you know, get whatever, 100 hours or something crazy out of the game. You, I want to make sure you're well prepared. Talent okay. and resolve are a potent combination. It would be a shame. To let that go to waste. Thank you, Professor. Don't let it go to your head. Now, let's see how you fare with Defindo. Wand at the ready. Okay, we get to learn Defindo as well. Be dangerous if you're not paying attention. Okay, it's another red spell. The red spells seem to be the best as far as like combat is concerned. Very good. It seems you have a grasp on Defindo. I would encourage. Mm, so let's try it, I suppose. Slashes objects and enemies from afar, dealing considerable damage. Ooh. Nope. Well, that's not what I wanted to do. There. Once again, to practice here in the classroom. Good for you. For your sake and that of everyone else. Dang, that's a cool move. No worries, I got you, bro. And we're officially level uh 23, which I probably means I actually have um Hold up, let me brew. Do I have that? Oh, I don't have thunder brew. Okay, so we'll have to buy the recipe for that. Um, I guess we can brew this then. We'll leave that to brew. Um, what was this saying before? Now, I completely was it two pinches of forgot. We'll just bring up. Oh, talents. That's what I was going to say. I'm like, so I probably have a talent point to spend. Uh, let's get another core one. Uh, stupefy mastery. That would be nice. Uh, more healing. Blocking a spell perfectly will set. Ooh. Basic cast impacts on airborne enemies contributes much, much more to the ancient magic leader. Ooh. Maybe I just skip this upgrade and just go for this one right away, right? I like that all the talent points are the same. So, like, once you have a talent point, you can go on ahead and prioritize things in whatever way you choose, which is very, very nice. Like, that is a great decision. Uh, let me bring up the map again. So we can just teleport. I keep forgetting about that. Okay, to the astronomy wing we go. Oh, uh, that seems pretty close. So, let's teleport over there. What type of dreams do knights have? Nightmares. Brilliant. Brilliant. Are these characters calling you? No, they send you a letter, basically. Because, like, in the Harry Potter universe, I don't think there are phones, as in, like, cell phones or anything like that. So I think that they send you a letter via, like, um, owls and stuff, you know? Do, 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 do. Okay. This is actually not bad because we do have that one description that we could do um, for the purple hat, I want to say it is. But maybe it'll be a high rarity. Deke. Ah, Deke is so happy to see you. Deke noticed this bag in the room the other day. You must need it to help with your schoolwork. Deke has seen one of these before. Ooh, Deke ooh, calls it ooh. a knapsack. What the heck is that? Is that like a vacuum in a bag? Perfect. 
fit for gathering and transporting. Mm. Got it. So now <laughs> we have a way. I have been thinking about something Professor Howen said in Beasts class that I should study as many beasts as I can on my own time. She also mentioned that poachers have been active in the area. So, perhaps the beasts will be safer with us than out on their own. Precisely what Deke was thinking. You see, the room knew exactly what you needed. And luckily, Deke can show you how to best Hyper, use Hyper, thank you for the super! And where? Hey, played around two hours of this game has been amazing so far. I love using Levioso on the Come along, then. hats and then the basic spell to send them. <laughs> wow. Hyper, this is <laughs> this is highly troubling. This is a highly troubling super chat. Um, I mean, okay, hold up. No, let me get this first. Uh, <laughs> that's like um, okay, kind of thing. You know, that's how I feel about that. You're 12 hours in. Sheesh. Um, when'd you get the game? Can't do that. Can't do that. Da, 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 da. Dang, this one has a actual uh, trait on it, which would be nice to have. But the problem is it's way weaker than the other scarf that we have. So there's no point of changing up to it. Well, that stinks. Do, 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 Okay, let's learn how to use the knapsack, I guess. To use the knapsack. Perfect. Deke loves an outing. So you just got the game today and you're 12 hours in already? Sheesh. GG. GG, bubble nugget. How far are you? Or further than what I'm at? Like, story-wise. Because to be fair, I have been doing a lot of quest stuff as well. Like, side quests, I should say. Not just beelining for main story all the time. Nasty poacher. Dick hated working for him. He did horrible things to beautiful beasts. Oh. It was during those days that Deke first saw a knapsack. Uh, it'll be nice to see one used for good. Okay. We have uh, arrived. So? Deke enjoys coming here to watch the beasts, especially the puffle of puff skeins nearby. It will be nice to keep them safe. All you will need to do is get close, direct the open knapsack toward the puff skein, and in it'll go. All right. Okay. Uh, do I have to equip it? Oh, I do have to equip it. Okay, so let's place it there, I guess. Wait, what? No, you don't. Oh, you hold. Got it. Okay, so you almost, it, bro. This almost feels like a Ghostbusters mechanic. That's cool. Again, there's I'm so much here. It's like thing. astounding. It really is astounding how every time that I think we're done, like as far as new gameplay mechanics stuff, and I'm like, okay, now it's just going to be kind of like combat stuff, upgrading new spells. And then they're like, hey, check out this beast capture mechanic. You know? All right. Where would I find one? Deke knows of some to the west, nesting in a large tree overlooking Hogwarts. But we must be careful. Deke has seen poachers in the area recently. Deke will meet you there whenever you're ready. Okay. So fortunately enough, we can get there nice and quick using our broom. Has he gotten the broom yet? Yeah, of course, Hyper. I've already got upgrades on the broom. Like a, sp uh, no, not a speed. I think I have the handling upgrade. Dude, it's like Newt's case. It actually is. You're right, Galaxy. That's a good point. It is like Newt's case from uh, Fantastic Beasts. Imagine the case was bigger on the inside, like Doctor Who. I mean, it probably has to be, right? In order to be able to gather um, any sort of beast. Hello, Deke. Should we continue? Oh, good. Deke was worried about you, what with all the poachers in the area. Perhaps we should work quickly. The jobbernals are just... <laughs> what did I miss? You have armor now? Yes, if we put on an armor again. Because we got a new helmet. Used to slow flying beasts. Easier to get in close and use the knapsack. Roger that. Um... 
Do you have any advice on how I can rescue more elusive beasts? Levioso is not only helpful when rescuing flying beasts, it, it can also mm. help rescue beasts that are generally hard to catch. Try using so you can slow them down and then use the... Yeah, that actually makes perfect beast. sense. That's a good strat. Um... Uh, would you mind talking a bit more about what it was like working for your former master? Wizard and armor? Was What's wrong with that? To beasts Have you ever played Dark Souls? He saw beasts only as a source of you can be a, a wizard in that. Bloodborne. And, labor and, and you could wear armor in that. Deke will not say more. But Deke is grateful to be at Hogwarts, where he can help care for beasts and make amends for the things his master made him do. Okay. Then I shall go and rescue a job and all. Good luck. Deke will be waiting. Roger, Roger. So, I guess we will use Lavioso. Lavioso. No, 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 no. No need to be difficult. Oh, no. no! <laughs> Dang it. Okay, now we have to back up again and I think just wait. I tried to use the ability, I think, from too far away. Holy moly, these things are so far up in the sky. Okay. Levioso. Boom. Wait, what? That one had two wheels. I'll look after you. Bada beam, bada boom. We got another magical beast. Hey, what's up? I rescued a job and all. Deke hopes your job and all finds the knapsack nice and cozy. Poachers want them for their feathers and are not kind when they gather them. Are there any other beasts nearby? Just one that Deke knows of. A herd of moon calves. They live in a clearing of trees up this footpath. Deke will see you there. Okay. Um, Man, I wish we could just snap our fingers like that and <laughs> teleport wherever we need to. That would be quite lovely. I mean, I guess we do have teleporting, but we still have to travel. All right. Hello, Deke. Is this the clearing you mentioned? It is. Moon calves gather near the large tree with the spiral pattern in front, but only under the light of the moon. So, unfortunately... Uh, Hyper, no worries. Good luck at work. Thank you so very much for hanging out. Much appreciated. You sometimes have to wait until nightfall to see them. Okay. I shall go and find a moon calf then. Deke will be waiting for your return. So I guess some beasts don't appear in daytime, so we have to wait for them. So we might actually have to uh, cycle the day and night cycle. Right? So the way to do that would be bring up the map, if I remember correctly. Then we press R3 and we wait. And if it's day, it becomes night. And if it's night, it becomes day. But would you look at that? Oh my goodness, dude. These things are very, very cool looking. Avioso. Three circles this time. Got him! That's three. <laughs> Bro. That thing looks cool. Hello. It was a bit trickier than the other. Another task completed. Another beast, safe and sound. Shame we didn't see the moon calves dancing. Uh, Siphon, I think you're right about that. His yeah, right ear does seem to, uh, uh, flap, to many flap moments, about a bit more. For now, let's bring the ones you've gathered back to uh, the never room. mind. Maybe he just wasn't right. moving his head. Deke will meet you back in the room whenever you're ready. Okay, sounds good. Return to the room of requirement. At this point, there's no point of flying over there on the broom because we can just do basically Hogwarts. Um, secret rooms, and then the room of requirement, and teleport. So now we actually do get to snap our fingers, and ta-da, appear right here. Brilliant. There you are. Doo -doo -boom -boom -boom. Now, we need Boom. to show the beast you rescued, then you home. Okay. But, um, not enough room to let them out here. Imagine all those beasts running amok. That wouldn't do at all. Perhaps if you focus on what your beasts need, the room will provide. 
Ah, so we're going to build some sort of, a, I guess, rooms for the beasts themselves. What the heck? Oh, what exactly did that looks like the building that Poison Ivy uses in Arkham Asylum. What is it? <laughs> sure. You've done it! Only but what is it? To find out. Have you seen any dinosaurs? Not yet. I don't if know if they're in the game, maybe. Ready. There are dragons, although I did call a dragon a dinosaur once by mistake. Whoa! Bro, look how beautiful it is! That looks lovely. Look at this. It's amazing. I know, that's what Where I just said. We, wow. Just it serenity. Be a place for your beasts to live, a vivarium of some sort. Oh, your beast will be quite comfortable here. Isn't that exactly how Newt's case fly. works, or no? Perhaps you want to release them, let them see their new home. Tap R1. Oh my goodness. Guys, this is really cool. Check this out. Da, 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 da. Oh, <laughs> Ta-da! That is lovely. Deke thinks the vivarium will be a fitting new home for your beasts. Indeed. I only hope we'll have enough space for all of them. Deke hopes so too. But if you do run out of room, Madam Peck at Brood and Peck in Hogsmeade will help to find safe homes for them. Any beasts that the room can't hold? Yes, she's well known for helping to care for beasts in need, and she'll give you a fair price for them. Speaking of care, beasts that are well fed and groomed will provide you with valuable magical materials, such as puff skein hair, for example. If you gather some magical materials from your beasts, Dee can show So I'm guessing we'll be able to craft stuff, maybe well. like new suits you know and stuff out of it eventually. Um, okay, so first we need to, um, bring up this, equip this, and this. Oops, I messed up. Equip the food one twice by mistake. Uh, which one am I? Oh, this. There we go. Okay, cool. Now we back out. Now we bring this up. Hey there. <laughs> Dude. Da, 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 da. Mm -mm -mm. Hidden room within a hidden room? Indeed. Hiddenception. This is cool, man. This, like, if you're a fan of, like, games like Animal Crossing or, like, um... Oh, uh, what's the game with uh, the farms? Not farm... Ville. What is it called? Like the farming game that a lot of people really like. You'd have a blast with this. Like being able to almost essentially build up like your own little like zoo kind of. Stardew Valley. Yes. Stardew Valley. Um, Pretty cool. Do, 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 do. Mm. Uh, Gabriel, I hope they don't attack one another. Hopefully they don't. That would be awkward. They're just chilling. We actually can collect moonstones over here as well, I think. Which is nice, because you can use moonstones for, um... What is it called? Uh, to build stuff inside the hidden room, like furniture and all that stuff. It requires moonstones, if you remember. So being able to farm moonstone in this little area, that's pretty lovely. And you just get, uh, let these guys just kind of roam about, do their own thing, you know? I did forget to collect the fur. There we go. So now, I guess we're going to learn some sort of a new building mechanic. 
again. It's some magical materials, Deke. Now Deke can show you how to use them. Okay. First, you'll need to use this spellcraft to conjure an enchanted loom. An enchanted loom. Exactly. It will allow you to use your magical materials to weave magic into the very threads of your clothing, making your clothing more useful in a variety of ways. Why don't you try it? Deke thinks you'll be impressed with what the loom can do. I'll go and experiment with the loom now. Okay. Do, 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 do. Teleport back through. So I guess what we need to do is actually conjure it first. I don't think I even have that spell anymore selected. Okay, so this will be the selection for the beasts. This is a uh, sneak attack. I guess this will be the combat wheel. And then I'll make this one into like the utility one. So we'll add this. This and this onto there. Um, I think it's this one to conjure, right? Do, 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 do. Where do we place it? Where? Oh, where do we place this one? I guess maybe over here. I don't really have a whole lot of space. Yeah, I don't think I can actually get it to be placed there. Can we go further down and just place it over here? We can, right? Perfect. Nope. Uh, I guess it'll just be there. But, um. Magical materials can be used with the loom to add or upgrade a secondary stat or apply. Oh, so we finally get our trade system. Sick. Yeah, that's nice. Um. Do I know what I currently have equipped? Is it this one? It is, right? Because it says equipped item, equipped item. So I assume, yeah. Okay, so let's say I want to upgrade this. It takes our defense up to six. Nice. Let's do it. Um, can I upgrade this? Nope. Can we add a trait? Bro, this is so cool. Look at all these traits, bro. I mean, come on. Look at, like, how long have I just been scrolling for? This is nuts, man. Holy moly. Every time that I think I'm like, okay, well, we've learned enough. It just goes, nope, here's more. Here's more. It, it really is stunning. Um, decrease damage taken, decrease damage taken, goblins. I don't really know if I want any of those because I do feel like this one is the best one right now, but let's see if we can equip maybe a trait to this. Ta-da! And just like that, we have a trait on our uh, scarf now. So if I build this up and just do like scorching one, does it stack? That's the question. Like, can I triple? So if I have three of them now, does it triple boost our attack? Because if it does, we're going to be melting enemies, literally. This is going to be nuts. I mean, I probably should actually equip it, right? Because I don't think this is incendio, right? Yeah, that's Confringo. This is incendio. So we'll equip that, obviously. If it stacks, it's going to be so powerful. It's going to be like crazy good. The enchanted loom, Deke. Wonderful. Uh, Would I be able to weave even more powerful magic into my clothing with the loom? You Four will. hours I later. I want to see and beast. play a very so similar now, game where you create your own student and study the at the Comartage to become to the sorcerer. The beast, that would be incredible. Bro. If somebody makes a mod you help, for Deke. this game to be Doctor Strange or like a Sorcerer Supreme in general, that would be literally a genius idea, Chris Evans. A genius idea. That 100% should happen yesterday. 
It's oh, an absolutely brilliant, brilliant idea. Plant that. I think we can just teleport, right? For our next quest. I mean, think about that. That would be so cool. A way to become the Sorcerer Supreme. Oh boy, that is far. Holy moly. Do I have any flu flames that are nearby? There's one here, no? The bridge. Take us to the bridge. To the bridge we go. Looks like a place right out of a storybook. Agreed. Okay, here we go. We're gonna have to ride the broom because we don't have flu flame, unfortunately, on the way. So for now, we just kind of fly through. Dude, one of my favorite things is flying through the trees like this because I swear it reminds me a little bit in Star Wars when they have the speeder bikes, you know, being able to just like fly through by the trees and at a pretty crazy pace. I think we have to go all the way around, don't we? Uh, this is awkward. Um, we can't go through the mountain. You my dream of a world. I think I have to go around the whole thing. Should patent that probably. You should literally message Marvel games and be like, hey, so I had this idea. Do, do, do. So we got to go meet up with Sebastian in Feldcroft. Na, na, na. Can we fly? Nope, 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 nope. Cannot. There's an invisible barrier there. Wait, what the heck is going on with our armor? Did it just rust over? Do you guys see that? Look at the armor. Why is it all like... Hold up. Let me stop. Oh, is that just the light bouncing? I can't tell. Doesn't it look like the armor is like rusted? That looks so strange. Did it for real just rust? I don't know. It looks like it, doesn't it? Oh, maybe... Uh, maybe it was just the light? Yeah, never mind. Maybe it was the light. It could be the flames, like the orange light from the broom reflecting onto the suit itself. That could be what's happening, actually. To be fair. Hello there. We've arrived. We wait for Sebastian. You made it. We have. Enjoying the view. Keeping an eye on things. Feldcroft isn't what it used to be. Mm. No one has felt safe here since Ranrock's loyalists took a peculiar interest in that castle over there. Rookwood Castle. My uncle Solomon is a former Aura and refuses to look into it, even after Anne was cursed by one of them. Possibly with a wand, no less. I heard a goblin refer to wizard kind as wand carriers. A goblin's forbidden from carrying wands. Precisely. That's why I'm on the hunt for answers. If I'm to cure her, I need to understand what happened to her. Anne was always the most mischievous of the three of us. Which is saying something, knowing me and Ominous. I'm hoping a surprise visit from me and a new friend from Hogwarts will help lift her spirits. Bring back the Anne I used to know. Come on, I'll take you to my uncle's. Okay, let's go! This way. Lead the way. Uh, there's a flu flame. Perfect. We'll be able to teleport here now. You can't. With Ranrock's lot wandering about all the time, everyone stays out of sight. Bro, maybe the armor did rust. Here we are. My sister. What the heck? Bro, I think the armor did rust. That's insane. Bruh. Look at it. It looks like it's literally like rusted armor now. Okay. 
I mean, we're going to have to change our tire, of course, but again, pretty insane. The fact that we went through an area where there was rain. So because of that, the armor rusted. Uh -huh. Like what? Sebastian, where did Crazy you... attention to detail. Is that, is that an is onion? We've been over this boy. Oh. Shrivel pigs cannot reverse a curse. Nothing can. Onion. The sooner you accept that reality, the better. But we haven't tried everything. There is no cure. When will you accept that? Never. I can never accept it. <laughs> now look what you've done. <laughs> I'm sorry. <laughs> The armor is back. Back to being silver. And now back to being. I'm sorry, you had to see that. I can't tell. Mind. What the heck? Just need a moment alone. Pulls Maybe it's just in. reflecting light. I have no idea. Come. Let's change up our outfit. Time to change up. Let's just change it on up. Do we go with the Riddler look or the Mad Hatter? We could we could rock and roll with the Mad Hatter look. The Mad I don't remember what kind of glasses does Mad does Mad Hatter even wear glasses? What the heck was that? Okay, well that's <laughs> that that's a look. Sure, we'll try that. Why not? Something a bit different, you know? If we could have this attire in um, green, we could really do kind of like a Riddler sort of inspired look, which would be neat. I don't think this change. Oh, it does change the pants, actually. We'll rock and roll with that. That's going to be the new look. The new look. Have I completed a challenge? I didn't even realize that. Oh, yes, I have. Bro, look at that mask. That looks mad. Let's see. I'm actually curious to see what the mask looks like. Uh, up here. There it is. Bro, if that doesn't scream uh, Court of Owls... I don't know what does. That is cool. Uh, oh, wait. We, we got to go speak with Anne and Solomon. I'm sorry about earlier. Those bouts of pain are difficult to bear. Well, how may we help, I suppose? Are you right, Anna? <laughs> Just I didn't the mask. I probably shouldn't have put on the mask right now. Truly. And I'm all right. The pain from this curse comes in bouts, and often it doesn't suddenly, fit. it's not anyone's fault. It's nice to meet you, by the way. You must be the new fifth year Sebastian told me about. I am. Sebastian and I met during a rather lively duel in defense against the dark arts. Oh dear, Professor Hecate. She's a powerful witch. And she knows how to keep students like my brother, and me, in line. I do miss Hogwarts. But I wouldn't mind being in Feldcroft, really, if it wasn't so dreary now. Between the goblins at the castle and my uncle fighting with Sebastian whenever he's home, it's not the cozy retreat it once was. Sebastian mentioned something about your uncle being an ex-Aura, but refusing to go after Ranrock's loyalists. I must say, I wasn't prepared for him to be as angry as he was. Uncle Solomon is frustrated by what happened to me and by Sebastian for thinking he can fix it. Both mean well, I know they do, but my uncle is right. This curse cannot be undone. I can feel it. Sebastian cannot take away my pain. Perhaps you can help him to understand that. Hey. I'll do my best. I can That's, promise uh, it. pretty, Thank um... You. His search for a cure is futile, I'm afraid. I'm getting tired. I should probably rest. Thank you for stopping by. Pretty well. sad. Whew. Now we gotta go talk to Sabat. Oh no. We gotta talk to Solomon. Nerve. Let's talk Excuse to Solomon. Me, Mr. Sallow. Oh yes. 
Sebastian's friend. I apologize on behalf of my nephew. He doesn't know when to stop. I was about to check on Anne. Did I see you come from the house? How is she? She's all right. She said she was going to rest. Nothing can be done for her. Mm. It could be that you've not yet discovered the cure. Ah, you sound like Sebastian, thinking you know better than the healers at St. Mungo's. Perhaps the healers don't know everything, sir. Sebastian is single-mindedly focused on finding a way to help his sister. If there is a cure, he will find it. Your faith in Sebastian is misplaced. Some sort of dark magic cursed Anne, and the goblins aren't likely to explain ah, themselves any time soon. Giving her hope is cruel. The only thing to do now is keep Anne comfortable and stay out of the loyalists' way. I understand what you're saying, sir. Good. I know what's best for Anne and Sebastian. They are my stubborn brother's children. Especially Sebastian. If you really want to be of help, you'll make sure Sebastian does what he should do, not what he wants to do. He's no idea the harm he could do if he doesn't stop. I hope you remember what I've said. Good day. Okay. I hope to see how Sebastian's faring. Why will he not listen to me? She's my sister. How are you doing, Sebastian? You got a first-hand glance of what I'm dealing with. I apologize for my uncle. Mm. I know he's angry, but he's only trying to do what he thinks is best for Anne. He's always angry. He's been angry since my parents died. After Anne was hurt, he only grew worse. It's as though he blames me somehow, always calling me my father's son, as if that's an insult. I'm the one trying to help her. He's simply given up. Both Anne and your uncle seem genuinely convinced that nothing more can be done for her. I refuse to believe that. Anne's pain is more than physical. It has changed her entirely. I miss my sister. And I'm going to get her back. Come with Ooh, me. That lemon. I show you where it happens. Power. Okay. Ranrock's loyalists are capable of so much more than people realize. They should not be underestimated. I don't think anyone underestimates them. State, <clears throat> they've been digging for something. Okay. We follow there, along. On that plateau, is where they cursed Anne. This way. I mean, we could just fly up there, no? The broom. Oh, right. We can't use the broom right now. Ah, uh, there's enemies up ahead. A lot of enemies up ahead, actually. Adam? Oh, we could have done this stealthily. I didn't realize that. I thought they all spotted us already. I could have probably actually fought this with stealth. Woo! That's a cool move. Yo, Incendio with the power up is pretty clean. You've made your last mistake. Okay, we need purple spell first. I'll bury you in the Hit him with that. Incendio. Then we can incendio. Hit him with the ancient magic. <laughs> Bro, he got absolutely yeeted. Dang it. Gotta stay focused, though. Dang it. Thank goodness we have pretty good defense because otherwise. This would be doing a lot of damage. I should just heal. I'm gonna barrel roll away. If 
we can pull them. Bro, how many enemies are there? Hey, just back up. I've been fighting since before you were born. Ooh. I confess. Holy. That's a bit more than I bargained for. There's a I lot of enemies. Okay, where to? Up the hill? Those loyalists deserved what they got. Couldn't agree more. This is where it happened. We smelled smoke in the middle of the night. When we looked outside, flames were shooting. Uh, Chris Evans, I just think games are so much more... I could stop her. And rushed out. Complicated nowadays? Fire, worried someone would be hurt. She came face to face with a horde of goblins, frantically trying to stamp out the flames. Suddenly, an icy voice drifted out from somewhere in the smoke. Children should be seen and not heard. A blinding blast followed. They didn't even give her a chance to run. Hmm. It seems an awfully violent response to a child wandering by. What were they trying to hide? My thoughts exactly. It may be grasping at billywigs, but I keep thinking that there might be something here that could lead me to... <laughs> what the heck are billywigs? Is that like, um, to learn what straws? The equivalent of grasping a straw? help me find a cure. Perhaps you're right. The loyalists are everywhere, but they do seem to be spending a lot of time here, and it's likely they're hiding something. And hmm. at Rookwood Castle. Shall we have a look around? I mean, I suppose. I don't know if we can go for Rookwood Castle right now because that will surely be crazy. Ooh. What's this? I've heard that goblin dig sites like these are popping up everywhere. Hmm. So they must be searching for some sort of a specific resource, maybe, right? Always armed and ready for a fight, Ranrock's loyalists. Hmm. Because if they are dig sites, that means that they're most likely looking for some type of a resource specifically that you could find underground, right? Rebellion. So whatever the equivalent of oil or maybe some sort of a rock, a crystal, a mineral. Uh, there is a furnace here or what looks like a furnace. Whose home was this? Bit of a home? Since I've lived here. Rumor was a Hogwarts professor lived here once. Same Looks like a stove. But that's all I ever heard. Or a furnace, really. It might be worth taking a closer look at the house itself. Oh, up there? Okay. I got it. I like how the game basically helps you. It like, tells you, like, hey, what are you doing over here? Go search over there. Do, 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 do. Okay. Is this not the... Maybe this is the house? Hold up. There's something up here. This well looks familiar. Nothing within the well. Something's in the well. I've seen this before. I say... Mm. This house, the well, the view. What do you mean? When? Give me a moment. I'll explain in a second. Revelio. Go back in. There's something on the wall there. Mirror, mirror. Sebastian. Oh, it's a painting. You know. Over here. Do you think that this was damaged by the fire the night that Anne was cursed? Could be. But it looks to me as though this was intentional. Could that be related somehow to Anne's curse? Sebastian. This house did belong to a Hogwarts professor hundreds of years ago. Who? What do you... I found a pensive that day in the restricted section with a memory that showed this house. <laughs> For real, my dude tried saying mirror, mirror on the wall with a painting? Because it looked like a mirror from far away. Well. The girl became a Hogwarts professor. Her name was Isadora Morganark. Everything is she starting to come together. The keepers, like in Quidditch. 
And you found a pensive in the library. Ooh. I realize it's a lot to take in. I'm not even sure I understand it all yet. And no, not like Quidditch. They call themselves keepers because they're protecting. Remember, Isadora the was the one that we would see in the um. It has to do with the vault, at Gringotts. Um, Let me see if I've got this the memories you that were and Rookwood after popping up because of something you found at Gringotts, where you ended up via a port key, and now you've been witnessing memories left by keepers. Oh, and this house belonged to a Hogwarts professor who was one of these non-Quidditch keepers hundreds of years ago. If I didn't know you. I think you were pulling my leg. It is all a bit much, isn't it, when you put it like that? The point is, we both have good reason to search this house. You for answers about what happened to Anne, and me for answers about the Keepers. Hmm. Look at this. Someone piled this here for a reason. Is it blocking something? The ball is way to find out. Uh... Accio. Huh, a stairwell. Yep. Revelio. Nothing else. Why bother blocking a stairwell? There might be something. Who's the Oh, that's a bad closer look. They've left all of this simply strewn about. Tells me they're after something bigger. There's journal entries. Ah, uh, more of a Hey, look at that! It seems like there's some sort of a plague or something here, you see? A journal entry of Isadora's. I should hold on to Second this. Second entry. I regret not having done more. Can I not look into the eyes knowing that I could have lessened the burden of heartache? I saw the man leaving the camp today. One who was reminded he was my father, surely it would not have heard him. Hmm. Seems these journal entries are from Isadora's travels. Are there more? Oh. Reve <laughs> There's a mirror! I'm not going to believe this. I can see the Undercroft. What? A daydream? Because that happens to me too. I know it sounds strange, but... Honestly, I nothing you say sounds strange to me. <laughs> Fair enough. That's a that's a sentence that you never want to hear from anyone. Nothing wall. you say to There's me is strange anymore. Like this has oh, happened okay. before. I'm listening. I have a rare ability to see whispers of ancient magic. I don't know what I was expecting you to say, but it wasn't that. <laughs> I knew you weren't telling me everything. Ancient magic. What does that even mean? I'm not entirely sure. But the Keepers have said that it's a powerful magic that should only be wielded by a select few. And you can wield it? I don't know. But Fig and I think that Ranrock has somehow found a way to harness that magic's power. Are you telling me that goblins may be wielding some sort of wizard magic? That's what we're trying to find out. What I do know is that my ability allows me to travel through these windows, I see. Wait. We can get straight to the Undercroft from here. <laughs> Ominous will be flawed. We can, but perhaps best not to tell anyone else about this for now, even Ominous. Understood. Well then, invisible secret ancient magic passageway, here we come. Um, I'm tempted to hold my breath. Sounds good. So, it looks like the Undercroft is next. Uh, talk film. What's up? How are you doing? Thank you so very much for saying hello. Why would the door lead us here? Sebastian, look. Dude, that's like the doors from or like the paintings from God of War. There is some sort of a note left behind. Oh, triptych here. Rebellion. as if something's missing. A note. That's Interesting. So that literally teleported us back down to the Undercroft within Hogwarts, which I guess makes you think like, why are those two places connected, right? Unless if maybe this was a pathway that like Isadora used to use to teleport back and forth from that house 
which is why there was a scarred painting of possibly Isadora herself that was burned. So we're starting to put things together, you know? Pretty interesting, indeed. All right, before we proceed onwards and forwards, I'm going to quickly go use the washroom, grab myself another tea, and then we'll keep on keeping on. In the meantime, guys, uh, stand up, uh, do a little stretch, you know, take a little breather, walk around a little bit, get some water, whatever drink you want, anything, and uh, BRB. Just a quick little break. again let's proceed ladies and gentlemen okay so we have a so this is the symbol that we've been seeing all along anything helpful in the notes a rune symbol i've seen similar symbols used by the keepers i've been thinking a keeper lived in that house centuries ago and ranrock and his lot have been searching there you said that goblins may be wielding some form of this ancient magic. Do you think Anne was cursed by ancient magic? I guess it could I be possible. Sure, of course, but I don't think so. Oh, never mind. I didn't see any traces of it around your sister. That's very true as well, because he would have uh, well. seen the glow or whatever. That doesn't mean it's not ancient magic. There's still so much we don't know about it. True. Perhaps this triptych will lead us to answers. What then we'll the have heck to is a triptych? But now I need to see Ominous. Don't What's with the chairs? I won't tell him. Uh, anything. Blitz Did chair. I that apparently, Salazar Slytherin had a secret scriptorium here in Hogwarts. You did not. Sounds worth looking into. Any idea where in the castle? No idea. Ominous just learned of it. I'll let you know what I find out. I had no idea our visit to Sian would unfold into all of this. My head's an utter mess. But I'm glad you told me everything you did. I'll be in touch. Okay. Till then. Sounds good. That's the main exit, right? I think. Uh, what's up, Blink? How are you doing? Imagine using portal instead of the broom. Man. That would be pretty sick. Meet me near the ruins of hey, there's Natty. Do not okay. tell anyone. Oh, but this is probably another side quest. Most likely. Let's see. We have two main quests though available. So it looks like one of them I can't 
Why can't we go? Oh, because we need to learn Vingardium Leviosa first. Right? Acquire and use Mandrake on multiple enemies. Okay. Do we have that? Mm -mm. Uh, probably not, huh? Where would that be? Uh, that's not under inventory, is it? Because this is only like resources. Yeah, I don't think... I don't think I have that unlocked yet. Uh, that's fine. So then let's do the other main quest. The one that we can tackle for now. Uh, astronomy class. Okay. So that will be our next area to visit. Surely I'm going to find some better loot. Like, what is happening? How am I not finding any loot that's higher level than what we've had for, like, so long now? This is crazy. Had the same, like, loadout of items for the longest time. Does look like a challenge of some sort is completed. Uh, the room of requirement. Okay, maybe not. Maybe just progress, I guess. Yeah. Okay. To the map we go. Uh, so that would be in the astronomy wing. And what's the closest place? Probably the charms classroom. So we go to the charms classroom and then scale up i think to the astronomy class because i would assume the astronomy class should be at the very top of hogwarts um because i'm assuming you're probably at some point in time in the class look at the stars which would require you to have a telescope which would require you to place said telescope quite high up Go this way. And then after this, I'm going to go figure out what a Mandrake is so that you we can that uh, unlock Vanguardium Leviosa. I don't know what that even means. Revelio. Can we scan this? Wait, can we go all the way to the top? Whoa, what is that? There's like some creepy whispering over here or something. You hear that? What is making that noise? I don't know. Highly suspicious. Something dinged. <laughs> Bro, peeves. Rebellion. Always trolling us. Lumos. So that looks like a telescope. My guess is that that's probably higher up. Yep. Somewhere here, there's a butterfly. Can I interact with this? There's an owl. That thing's cool. Maybe even higher up than this. Whoa, look at this place. Holy moly. This is a very beautiful looking area. This kind of like balcony area. There's the butterfly. Found that. Hello. Dude, look at that telescope. That's cool. Do, 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 do. Run back down. Run back down. So that'll let us complete this mission. Um, let's go. Hit Lumos again. Get another field guide page. This one probably talks about astronomy class, maybe? Or something like that. And back down we go to the class itself. Where I don't actually know what will be covered. The mind. Oh, the mandrake is the, the crying plant baby. Got it. Got it, got it, got it, got it. So never mind. So what does it mean obtain one? Aren't they supposed to always be like burrowed under the dirt or whatever? Because otherwise they're like Hello, screaming. 
Okay, so I'm waiting for these things to spin. I got one. One piece of the puzzle is saw. Oh. Go back. Where did it... It just started spinning and then it stopped. It was like right here, no? Got it. Ta-da! Got the lock. Uh, within it, a scarf that's once again a lower level than what we have. I don't understand why we're not getting any better loot. What's up, Optic? How are you doing? Thank you so much for tuning in. Is the dragon? That's exciting, I suppose. Perhaps you're due for an adventure. Mm. <laughs> what an outfit to show up in, right? Ladies. Straight up, don't be job. suspicious. Astronomy is not divination. You won't find the mysteries of the cosmos charted out on your palms or at the bottom of your teacups. Alas, the heavens remain hazy to the starry-eyed. Now, if you were to devote yourselves to persistent and painstaking observation, you just might catch a glimpse. With that in mind, please take your telescopes. Tonight, we will be on the observation deck. Okay. Let's do it. Looks like everybody uh, did not dress up for the colder weather. You can't be the new student forever, you know. You can share with Mr. Takar. Um, uh, okay. <laughs> That's definitely a glitch. On your own. This is the first, like, crazy glitch we've seen. That was funny. Uh, how do we focus? Do we... Oh, there we go. Oh, wow. That looks nice. <laughs> We're literally phasing through that character. Or I guess maybe that character is phasing through us. But, Professor, it's freezing out. Mere cold didn't stop the great stargazers of the past. Look only to the astronomy tables they erected throughout the highlands from which they gazed millennia ago on the very self-same stars above us. Is that clear? <sighs> Dismissed. Hello. I don't believe we've met officially. Oh, this I'm is Amit. Amit. I'm something of an astronomy buff. Hello, Amit. It's nice to meet you. Who had mentioned him? I forget. Was that Sebastian or was that uh, Natty? I have a spare one you could borrow for the rest of term. Um, sure. That's very kind of you, Amit. Are you sure you won't need it? I'm certain. It's my old one. I finally got my hands on the new Celestia Contemplor. You've heard of it, I assume? I mean, of course you have. It's only the pinnacle of all personal stargazing implements. But my old model's not too shabby either. <laughs> You're the god at finding glitches? I do find a lot of glitches in video games. I don't know why. Just collecting dust. Well, I, I, thank you, Amit. Think nothing of it. Anyway, the telescope's in the storage room right underneath us. You can't miss it. I have some, uh... Reading to finish on the lower deck. Come find me there afterwards and bring the telescope. There's something I want to talk to you about. Okay. Uh, find a meat's telescope in the storage area. Alrighty, Roo. Um, did we go back down? I forget. I guess just. Oh wait. Uh. Wait, what the heck? Where? Why does it look like it's inside the wall? Um. Oh, there's a little staircase right here. Got it. Revelio. We need to switch. Incendio. Pass the fireball onto that. Get this. this. There's the telescope. telescope. That's practically brand new. 
Still can't get better loot. What is happening? I would love to get some better loot game. Please give me better loot. Hey, what's up, Manny? How you doing, bro? I'm something of a scientist myself. <laughs> Yo, Bob, you excited for tomorrow? There is um something else. Yes, what is it? You remember those astronomy tables Shaw was going on about? It just so happens I've been reading up on them a little myself. And it seems there may be one right here at Hogwarts. I believe we could use it to find hidden constellations. Um... How can we help you with that? I mean, I you seem to be way more knowledgeable on that, so... I do. Are you in? No one sure. from the Stones Club will go with me. Said they'd rather get spit at by a stone than... Well, they are cowards. Let us get moving while the stars are still out. I'll show you how to use that telescope once we get there. I promise. Okay. Well, I suppose we could help. Oh, I mean, I don't really know I what we would be doing because we're I not knowledgeable on the topic whatsoever. Be, trust me, but I have read practically sure. everything there is to read about this. It should be brilliant. Shall we? Yeah, that's why you're qualified to help with this. Us, not so much, but okay. Doing well. Went to pick up my uh, comics and got an unpaid internship. Wow. The table is on a castle at, wall ahead. Where? At a Look comic a book store? Or? Something that doesn't quite belong. We'll know it when we see it. Onwards we go. Some say the locations of the tables were originally marked by centaurs. Yeah, Gabriel, I think that's the only thing we can do is basically like provide support as far as like casting spells and stuff. Like, uh, It is nice having a fellow stargazer to explore with. Happy to be here. It is good to leave the classroom now and then. Oh yeah, Optic, uh, stick around. I'll definitely have lots of questions. The Gobstones Club are here. I am charging ahead. Uh, why don't you lead the way? <laughs> here I am charging ahead. Why don't you take the first steps, though? Okay. Revelio. Okay. Hmm. A little foreboding. Uh, are these the shrubs? Nothing to be concerned about. Oh, of course. It's just not as tidy as I expected. Revelio. A caged bathtub. This bathtub has been kept behind lock and key for as long as anyone can remember. Rumor has it is that the tub was enchanted to chase after students decades ago who were too obsessed with their studies to care much for personal hygiene. Okay. That's actually funny. There is like a, a, a similar-ish um, like um, a children's storybook like um, growing up that I remember would always like my grandma would always read it to me and stuff about also a bathtub that would chase you if you didn't brush your teeth, wash your hair, all this stuff, which is kind of funny. I wonder if that's related to that or not. Uh, no, the com Community College Foundation. Nice. Congratulations. I mean, if you're excited for it, that's awesome. Oh, so that's what those were. Okay. The const I, I do see it. So what do you want me to do now? Oh, I have to match it. As soon as you've lined up the telescope, we will be able to fill out our star chart. Pretty close, no? Ta-da! It's Lyra? I don't know anything about astronomy. I was right okay. about the tables. They really are gateways to the far stars. Although it is fascinating when you read up and your about astronomy in terms of like valuable. how they were able Rest to predict sure. things we like crazy specific things that we can do nowadays with like modern science, but they were able to do it by reading the stars and stuff. Kind of crazy. Thank you, Amit. I look forward to reading them. And I look forward to writing them. <laughs> this is only the beginning. You will find more tables like this one throughout the grounds and forest, all beckoning to be discovered by a worthy astronomer. And if I have ever seen one, it's you. Oh, and about my old telescope. Don't bother returning it. You should keep it. That's quite generous. Thank you. You are welcome. It has goblin cut glass and a gobbledygook inscription. 
I'm practically fluent in gobbledygook, you know. It's all in the throat, really, gobbledygook, you know, and, and how you pronounce your R's. Okay. Ahem. Anyway, glad our adventure was a success. I will see you soon. Sounds good. Mission complete. We level up. Level 24 reach. Holy moly. 340 XP. Thank you, game. That is very generous. Okay. So W. There's the door. Actually, I could probably just teleport, right? So we need to learn Vanguardium Leviosa before we can proceed to the high keep. Because as you can see, it says required level 17, which we're, we're well past that uh, being level 24 already. But I do need to learn Vanguardium Leviosa, which requires us to use and acquire Mandry. Where the heck do we get it? I guess that would be in the Herbology class, right? I suppose. Was it available for sale in Hogsmeade? Where would it be sold? Maybe in the potions shop? Right? Probably the potion shop. Let's go check. Let's go check. That's a W. Here I come. Don't know what happened, but the stream kept lagging. Um, I don't know. Zero drop frames for me. But welcome back. Uh, thanks for tuning back in. Um, yeah, Optic, please don't uh, do self promo stuff. Good luck to you. Uh, but thank you again for delivering those potions to Madame Lawing. Save me a lot of time and trouble. Please don't do that. All right, so we can finally buy the Thunder Brew recipe, which oh, I do need. Decision. Thank you. And then this guy doesn't actually have. Hmm. I thought for sure Pippin would have. Um. A wise decision. Thank you. Those items. So. I guess we'll have to go to the herbology class then. But first, I might as well just sell off all the inventory that we don't need. Because all of this stuff is like way less powerful than what we currently have. So, there's literally no purpose in carrying any of this stuff. So, we're just going to sell everything. There we go. Recoup a good amount of our gold coins. And with that... Farewell for now. Thank you. We head back out. Now. Um... Bum, 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 bum. So, Hogwarts it is. Nope. Uh, let's head for the greenhouse and hopefully we can get uh, a mandrake there. You can get the mandrakes at dogweed. Handy resource indeed. Dang it. Field guide. I'm most pleased to be included. Galaxy! Why can't you type faster? I mean, also, thank you. I was just there. <laughs> Which store? Dogweed and Death Cap. Mm -hmm. I don't have a store like that. There's wizard wear. Maybe it's this. Um, I don't think I have that, um, store. Uh, yeah, for sure. Uh, Bob, I'm probably going to play, um, a bit more hi-fi rush. Maybe get the next boss fight done. Cause I know that's a pretty short game. I think it's like maybe, you know, eight hours. So I should be able to, over the course of a few weeks, finish that. And then some COD. I don't see any stores um, by that name. So. Unless if it's one of these ones. Hmm. 
No. Yeah, I don't see it. Maybe we could talk to the professor. Mm. Yeah, that doesn't really help us. Why aren't you... Maybe they're over by the second room, like the second herbology uh, class. Uh... Dang. Oh, what's this? Nope. The icon's a mushroom. Yeah, but a mushroom... I think that's just... I don't think there is a place like that in Hogsmeade. Maybe there's one on the map? Like the world map? Even though I still don't see it. Like, I suppose it could be maybe somewhere down here. But we'd have to, like, fly across and, like, use... Uh, uh, unlock a bunch of flu flames to see in the vicinity. Um, I just thought like they would be available in the in the herbology class because that's where we saw them before, right? Remember, like there was a whole cutscene for it. So, kind of peculiar that it's not here, honestly. There's a store somewhere north of Hogsmeade. Really? Hold up. I'm just going to check this one other part of the herbology. Uh, nope. This already takes us outdoors. I checked that level. I checked that level. Did I check? Did I check the second floor on this one? I don't think I have. Did I? But we might be able to actually... Quick run through here. Random chest. Interesting. Oh! Oh, no. Maybe that's one of them right there. No. Yeah, I don't know. That's kind of surprising. Okay. Let's zoom out then and head for Hogsmeade. And maybe we could find it just by traveling over to Hogsmeade. And looking... Oh, you're right! There it is! Holy moly! Yo, Galaxy Big Brain! Thank you! Thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you, thank you for the help. Uh, yeah, Manny, I need to just, like, look into it. Because it popped up, but I still don't understand how to actually make anyone a super mod. Or a, it's called a managing super mod or something like that. I need to figure out how to actually, like, go through the process of it. So, maybe I'll do that after stream. Uh, Jack, it's been pretty good so far. There. Oh, yeah, it is called Dogweed and Death Cap. You're right. You were 100% correct. Oh, we've been here before. I forgot this area. Well, let's see. We show you some of what's available. Okay, so I guess we'll buy all of these just because it would be nice to have all this stuff unlocked. I can tell you'll go far. Nutrient rich. Compost that can be added to plant. Sure. I probably shouldn't have spent this much on all this stuff. Okay. Well, we have a mandrake, so that's good. Um. Now we just have to go find an enemy. Or actually, no. It has to be multiple enemies. I'm guessing a mandrake is one of the... Yep. One of these items. So what is it going to do? It's probably going to act as like almost like a a, a flashbang or something like that in uh, most video games, right? Because it's going to create a bunch of noise. Oh, hello. 
quick, grab that. Because it'll probably just start screaming, right? Causing the enemies to, like, maybe become immobile or something like that. Let's go find some enemies, I suppose. We do need to find multiple enemies, though. And make sure they're close. So, this place has seen this better work? days. Hello. Thought we'd forget about that goblin hell news. Assignment's all finished. That work? Hey, 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 it did! Incendio. Incendio? It isn't Nora Trent. I know all. Crushed him. Absolutely crushed him. The beasts are safer now. Okay. That's really an expensive item, man. Because you're dropping 500 gold coins on something that is used for, like, one tiny little attack, and then you're done. So, I don't know if that's worth it, you know? Um, Wait, where do I need to meet up with the character? Attend Herbology. Yeah, so... Why is it teleporting me to the outside? It should be right here. This is where the Herbology class is. Is that not it? Hold up. Unless if maybe this one's outside? Huh. Go to the world map. Oh, wow. It, no, it is Hogwarts. What the heck? So why is it when I go to Hogwarts, it teleports me outside? Um... And then I just go to the greenhouses, because I think that's where the herbology classes take place. At least the previous ones that we took. The two previous ones. What are you up to now? And then but uh here we go. Let's do it! So if this is where we get to learn the most iconic spell in Harry Potter history, and that is Vingardium Leviosa, right? I mean, even me, like as a noob, when it comes to um, Harry Potter, Vingardium Leviosa, everybody knows. How wonderful to see you again. Professor Garlic, I love the name. I've completed my assignments, Professor. Pleased to hear it. Professor Weasley will be too. I'll be sure to let her know how well you're coming along. Thank you, Professor. Professor Hecate tells me she taught you Levioso, so you should be ready for a more advanced levitation charm. Wingardium Leviosa requires a bit of concentration and a nice graceful wand movement. Let's see you try your hand at it. Okay. When executed correctly, you should be able to pick up boulders as though they were sprigs of sneezeboard. Got it. It's almost like the letter Y. Casting Vanguardian Levioso. Control its position with your movement and use... Okay. Interesting. Can we make anything float or is it just certain items? I guess we could test it. Um, it's got to be... Where is Vingardium Levioso? Or is it just... Do I cast Levioso? I've set some crates out for you in the next room. So did it just upgrade? Uh, I legit have no idea. Did it just upgrade le uh, like Leviosa into? I think that's what happened. I think you just basically uh, unlock an upgrade to Leviosa. I don't see any new uh oh I lied. There is one. There's Vingardium Leviosa. So let's add that. So let's try that instead. Wait. 
How do I? Oh, I can't let go. I have to keep holding the R2 button. And then I could move this up, down, forwards, backwards. Dang, that's cool. So that will definitely be very handy when it comes to um, some of the puzzles that require like platforming and stuff like that. Um, it'll be nice, definitely. To be able to move crates now instead of just like have them follow you where you're basically like dragging them. Here you can actually like specifically guide um, which way they go. Okay. Uh... Sean, thank you so very much for the super chat. How's your day going, Blitz? It's going wonderfully. Thank you so very much for the support, man. Thanks for tuning in. Thank you, thank you, thank you so very much for uh, taking the time. Why not in a charms class? I don't know. Is it considered a charm? I mean, it, it would make sense that people who garden would have a lot of value in knowing a spell like Vanguardium Leviosa, right? Because you would be able to like remove roots and carry heavy plants and dirt and fertilizer so it kind of makes sense um we could attend this class as well real quick before we go meet up with natty again um I guess teleport there. I'm guessing because the force uh, awakens was in Lego Star Wars Skywalker Saga. I'm guessing they didn't have to make a full Lego game for the force awakens. Who agrees? Well, it's, it's hard to say something like that because you're basically applying like recent information to old. Um, games right because the force awakens lego star wars the force awakens released years before the skywalker saga was even in development so it's like now yeah you could retroactively say probably doesn't make much sense but back then i don't know if they knew that they were going to make uh lego star wars the skywalker saga right <laughs> Why was she so... She looked at him so confused, like, do you even know what you're doing? <laughs> that is a very judgmental view. What the heck is that? Oh, is that like reading your uh, future by coffee or something like that? What do we have here? I hope those assignments... I've completed all of my tasks, Professor Onai. Very well done. Although I must admit, I did have something of a premonition that you would follow mm. through. Now, as you have no doubt sharpened your perception by completing my assignment, I am curious, based upon the knowledge that one's present and even one's past may reveal traces of what is to come. What do you see in your own future? Whoa. We need to pick one. Triumph, danger, or power? I mean, I think danger is kind of the no-brainer, right? Because there's most likely going to be a danger when we head for the, tr the second trial, the third trial, and the fourth trial. Power makes sense as well, since we have the potential to control ancient magic. And triumph is definitely inevitable because we're going to win. So all three kind of make sense. So chat, is it about drive? Is it about triumph? Or is it about danger? It's about drive. It's about power. We stay hungry. So is it power? 
It's about family. <laughs> I wish that was a. I wish that was an option. If there was, it's. I see family. That would be. I definitely pick that one. Danger. I see a couple people saying uh, power though, so we'll go with power. I see good things. After all, the future's mine for the taking, and I shall take what I must. Okay, now we out here sounding like Kylo Ren. The future is not etched in stone. It can be carved out by those with very strong wills. And you Dang, look at Chase being all stone. profound. But this talk saying only a Sith deals in absolutes. That's very true. There's a lot more nuance to everything. I a good deputy headmistress of your exemplary performance. And if that performance is any omen of what your future may hold, then I, for one, see great things. Is her bracelet phasing into the... I think it was. Channel your magic towards your targets. Got it. Ascendo. Hey, what's up, Gaming Pizza? How you doing, man? You Descendo it. has been unlocked. Now, why not practice the new spell on the training dummy? Mm, 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 mm. I mean, I guess we might as well test it out. Um, Descendo. Okay. Defendo. Oops. Descendo. Holy moly, bro. <laughs> that's a crazy move. Like you be, that's almost like if you if you've ever watched wrestling, a DDT. Like head first. And put your newly honed skills to the test. That's crazy. Side of the classroom. Okay, hold up. One thing I I see this little statue there, so can we uh, transfer to nighttime because then we should be able to collect now, Demi, guys. an orb. Once you've completed the necessary tasks, Professor, that's not what I meant to say. I do. Never mind. I'm sorry. It seems now isn't the best time after all. Professor, you have a moment. Yes, I do. Now is not the best time. I I'm trying to collect the 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 moon thing. There. Thank you. Okay, now we can teleport back to our main quest. The High Keep. Uh, locate on map. Whoa, where is that? I guess it's probably best to teleport. Yeah, probably teleport here and then fly across, right? Let's do that. You're 100% Huffleguff. Got it. Resource indeed, your field guide. I've most pleased been We run and we fly. Look at that. Like that's fun. Just being able to like fly through the trees like this. It really does remind me of the speeder bike chase scenes in Star Wars. Dude, dude. Ooh, what's that? Oh, that's the other challenges. The Merlin statues. Hold up. Where's the flu flame? You can't enter while mount. Okay. Here we go. Hold up. Let me just activate this so we can teleport here whenever we want. Now let's begin the quest. Quietly. Okay. I'm what is Natty up to? We need to stay low and remain quiet. Natty, what's going on? Why are we all the way out here? As promised, I did some investigating to find out what Harlow is up to. I followed him to the Hulk's head. I noticed him reading a letter. All I could see was that it was signed by and bore the seal of Victor Rookwood. Well, that's and not good. And you told me that Rookwood and Harlow were after you, I decided that you were the perfect person to join me in taking them down. For good. That letter is the tangible proof that Officer Singer needs. It is why I followed Harlow here and why I wrote to you. I need your help to retrieve it. Um. I mean, we kind of know the other answer. I'll help you find the letter, Natty. I'm glad to hear it. 
First, we must access the castle keep. I'll check the main gate, see if you can find another way in. I do not see any guards, but we should still try to be as quiet as possible. Hollow is here after all. Okay. Oh. How nice to see you, my young friend. Who said? Oh, that's the flu flame. That scared me. I was like, who the heck said that? Guess we go here, right? Oh, what's that? Some Ashwinder eggs. Hmm. I wonder hmm. what that does. Fire spinning. Well, that didn't uh, work. Something with a bit more. That didn't things. work. That works. That did it. Arrest them, Okay. Then we need Levioso. Or Vingardium Levioso. Or Leviosa. Levioso is the one that just levitates. Uh, that's not going to be high up enough. Is there a second crate somewhere? Hmm. Unless if I suppose... What if I... Can I turn this crate? Uh, I mean, this lets you turn it. Can you stand on a crate while uh, hitting it with the Guardian of this? No. Could I maybe? If we get it like up here. And. Nope. Uh, let's think, let's think, let's think. Maybe get it closer than maybe cast regular. Um, let's see. What if I cast regular Levioso, right? Levioso. Got it. Don't know if that was the way to do it, but we solved the problem. That's what matters. Into the gatehouse to open the gate for Natty. Hmm. Let's go back. Can I not? Oh, I can't cast a spell here. Okay, so we need to figure out a way to move that crate out of the way. <clears throat> First. Dead end. Must Which be we can way. do. Accio. By pulling this. Then going back around. And then we should be able to actually uh, go through. Hmm. That looks as if it might raise the gate. Arrest the moment. Okay. No! I think I got it. Well done. I hey, hey. Puzzle solved. I knew you could do it. This way. I will get the door. Okay. Do we need the crate still, maybe? Just an, basically a hint. If you couldn't figure out how to open this, um, that was basically a letter to help you figure it out. That is the main keep. My guess is that we'll find Harlow and the letter inside. Harlow. Be careful once we get... Like the one from uh, Moon Knight? Yeah. Whoa! The hippogriff. Hi, Wing. Do you know that hippogriff? Very well. New plan. 
I get the evidence and you free that hippogriff. Agreed? This is our chance. Go! Run, 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 run! Um. Blasted. There's got to be another way to get up to the roof. Yeah, you should have just ran faster. And then we wouldn't have to deal yeah, with this problem. Out of trouble. Okay. Fine, I suppose. Can we pull that towards us? Oh, okay. And I guess we just go up. Where's the three-piece suit? Uh, maybe maybe on the next one. You know, maybe on the next one. You know? Because it's... um. We'll see. Depends how far we can get. Because I'm, I'm kind of surprised that I haven't even managed to get to one of the trials. Because I legit thought I'd get to at least... Uh, trial. Hopefully that was supposed to happen. Mm. Okay, so we need Lavioso. Or Leviosa, dang it. I gotta start remembering. Okay, so here's how we're gonna do this. I need um Leviosa. this that one not the two. safest place to sneak into. Boom. Probably should not have just bought him. Right? I could have just done this stealthily. I don't know why I. Because I could have just gone invisible and then just used stealth. Nice. Rebellion. Nothing else of value here. Um, let's go invisible. So, in theory. Boom. Whoa. Wait, what? How, I'm gonna how? How did that one? Was it from the previous fight? Got him. How did that other one just like appear and immediately know that we were there? What was up with that? Oh. Hang on, I thought I had it right away. Puzzle solved. Door open. Let's see what we got. Some gold coins. That's lovely. Make, make this climb. And we go for the easier time of it. Still can't open that because we don't have the Aloha Mora spell at level two. Um, I guess we might as well check what's up here first. I should have probably done Revelio to scan and make sure that there's no enemies first. Rookie mistake. Uh, I guess there's nothing up here. That's kind of odd. Yeah. That's very strange. Okay. What was that? You're going home in a wooden box. Okay. Nope. Back up. Dang it. I need a yellow spell. Um, and... Switch. Got him. Hoo-wee! We got another lock. Got it. 
I've gotten good at this puzzle. The first time that I did this puzzle, I felt like I spent like 20 minutes on it. Now I can actually get them pretty quick. Because now I actually know how, obviously, it functions. Rebellion. Whereas before that, it was just kind of trying to stumble through it. Uh, can we just clear this junk here? There we go. Still cannot Rebellion. get better loot for some reason. I really wonder if, like, I just over-leveled because of doing side quests. And so because of that, now the main quests keep rewarding us with loot that's pretty much immediately garbage. And we might as well just sell it off to the uh, shopkeepers right away. Careful. Give me a cross. Uh, I should keep an eye on my stash, eh? If it's yours, if I mysteriously disappear. That liar cheated us out, out of what was ours. So I took what I could and hid it here. 20 damned years and treated no better than fools who would have been here. Two blasted weeks. And once again, we get another row, but... It's once again useless because it's a lower power level than what we had before. I mean, I guess visually it's not useless because if it looks nice, I suppose we could still like wear the attire, but no value in terms Rebellion. of uh, utility. Oh, it's all right. There we go. Wait, there's um, uh, darker hippogriffs as well. That one looks cool. The one next to uh, High Wing. Um, I guess this is probably when we unlock hippogriffs. Uh, nah. Can multiple people be on one hippogriff? Oh, there we go. That's the answer. Wait, were those guys casting Avada Kedavra? Did you hear that? Dang. Okay, here we go. So, hippogriffs have been unlocked. This is pretty brilliant. Look at Hogwarts in the background. That looks so cool. And the train? There's the Hogwarts Express. Must be returning from an unscheduled run. This looks very uh, cinematic. Oh, we can dive. I didn't realize that. So you can go up and down with the arch stick. I thought it was like we were locked in on a path, like a train track, sort of. You can move as you see fit. I honestly can't tell if we're moving faster or slower than we do on the broom. Can we fly like right close to the water? Woohoo! It's incredible, isn't it? It is quite incredible. And the sun is coming up. Watch out. <laughs> How exciting. <laughs> it was exhilarating, wasn't it? I wasn't sure we, were <laughs> we to probably need to change the mask though. <laughs> there was no need to worry. I had it all under control. Were you able to find the letter? Summoned it straight out of Harlow's hands. <laughs> I will say, I did not expect to see him cast the killing curse at us. He won't forget this. Be on your guard. Of course. What did the letter say? That Rookwood's looking for a phoenix. <laughs> not sure where he will find one. But it also included Harlow's orders to inspect that castle for the poachers. Enough to connect Harlow to the crimes. 
I shall deliver the letter to Officer Singer. She'll have to do something when she sees him. Yo, Detective yeah. Natty is on the case. Where did you meet these hippogriffs? I've only met Hiram before. Poppy introduced us. Poppy Sweeting knows a hippogriff. <laughs> of course she does. Poppy will be relieved to know that Highwing's safe. I came to the right person for help. My mother will be worried. I must go. Seek me out soon. I shall have much to tell you. Thank you. And now we, I think, have unlocked Highwing. So now you can literally, um, I guess, traverse Highwing, go. the world. What is that? What was that thing? Sep what was the name of it? Sepulchria? New beasts have been unlocked. What the heck is a Sepulchria? Oh, there, 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 there. Look at this. Can we? I don't know what that is. If anybody does, it looked like a dragon of some sort. I assume we probably unlocked. Um... Mm. <laughs> Bro, just a fur coat. That's funny. The fire, it rises. Um, Andrew Basham. Thank you so very much for the insane, insane, insane continued support. You are an absolute mad lad. 33 months saying is wild. I know I'm not very consistent anymore, but I still love the content. Keep it up and W game. If you ever need help, I'm an expert. Sounds good, Andrew. Well, um, first and foremost, what the heck was that thing that I just unlocked? Is that a dragon? I guess that's, that's as good of a question as any. Trying to come up with a look that we haven't like done yet. I don't think I've used this green one, have I? Ooh, this looks kind of neat as well. The cape. Just the cape. Let's do that. Why not? Something something a little bit different. That looks cool. I'm just trying to mix it up, you know? with that and that that's a pretty good look that's a pretty cool look for the character da, da, da. do i need to nope don't get to unlock anything unfortunately i was hopeful we would get a reward but nope it's like a reward. Uh, stupefy deals direct damage. Let's get it. I do want to get all the core upgrades first, just so we kind of don't worry about that stuff anymore. That'd be I nice. It's a te he may be able to the testral or thestral, maybe. It can only be seen by people who've seen death at Latour. That's what you unlocked. Holy moly. I assume you have news regarding the gossip you mentioned. And we fly. We meet at the map chamber to discuss that and our next steps. Sounds good. When you have a moment, so, stop by the room of requirement. Deep oh, no. me he has something to share with you. So I don't know what that as far as the beast itself, like I don't know if we're Oh my goodness, the diaper look. Okay, we'll do the diaper look. You guys will just never give it a rest. Fine. Diaper look it is. Are you happy now? Are you happy? Are you not entertained? There. My goodness. It's always the diaper look, isn't it? Land and it will let you equip other beasts. Ah, so that's how you do it. Wait, how do you descend? There's R. 
Wait, so does that mean we can fly on that, uh, like, dragon-looking thing? Slow down now. How do we... we go. Oh, that's cool. Okay, so then I, now... Where do I go to equip the, the other beast? Do I go to inventory? Since I did see it in inventory, I suppose. Is it equipped now? Or is it under... I mean, it might be under here, actually. Bro! Okay, so you can equip... Holy moly, this thing looks so cool. Look at the blue eyes. You can equip Caligo. Uh, high wing or... Whoa, okay, this thing is not a dragon. It's like a creepy looking thing. Or a... Sep Sepulchria, Sepulchria. I mean, we'll equip it just so we can see what it looks like. So let's summon it. Whoa. Time for a jaunt, I'd say. Away. I mean, ascend. You have to go higher. There it goes. Looks like a starved goat. Uh, kind of. I feel like I remember this thing being in Lego Harry Potter. Am I wrong? Didn't this creature appear in Lego Harry Potter? It was like up on the hill where the Hogwarts Express was going by and you meet it um, for like a mission. There's like a quest where you either have to chase it down or something like that. If I'm recalling correctly. It's just crazy how many things are constantly introduced here. Smedley's will always look upon you as a trusted ally and friend. It really is stunning just how many different missions there are. Was I not supposed to go here? Uh, the bell tower wing. Okay. Let's teleport here, I suppose. Yes, they were in the forest in years five through seven. Roger that. Well, there you go. So I guess um, uh, memory served me correct. When my grandfather was Am I going the right way? Nope. Got to go back down here. Then I guess through here. Hello, hello, hello. Top of the morning to you. Something just dinged there. Can we open these? I thought maybe Aloha Mora um, opens that up. What was that noise? That sounded like there was some sort of a monster beast sound. Oh, it's another dinosaur, guys. Remember? Everybody's favorite dinosaur. Right? You guys remember the dinosaur? It was in the movies and in the games. I remember it being in specifically in the... Uh, Lego Harry Potter. At least I think that's the same creature. And chat is saying it is, so... I assume that's what it was. I, I... We go down here. Pum, 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 pum. Wait, there's a flu flame here? Why didn't I just teleport to that? You can't imagine how inconvenient travel was before I invented... Here we go. You would be wise not to underestimate this student. Their aptitude for magic is beyond anything I've ever seen. And I've been teaching a long time. It is a joy to have such a student. It can be. There you are. Yes, there we are. I received your owl. I was able to speak with Lord Gok, the goblin I mentioned before. What did you learn? He and Ranrock were close once, but they had a falling out. You believe he can be trusted? Um... For now, yes. I believe he's trustworthy, yes. He seems sincere, and Sirona Ryan trusts him. Very well. Supposing he can be trusted, will he help us get to Ranrock? I retrieved a stolen helm. He hopes to return to Ranrock in order to regain his confidence. You have been busy. 
Let's hope your efforts result in our learning something about Ranrock's plans. Lord Gok did mention that Ranrock is searching for something, but he couldn't say what. Perhaps that helm will yield some answers. Ranrock is searching for something? I feared as much. I've heard an unusual amount of activity, goblins and wizards, I surmise, when visiting my portrait at my castle. Rookwood Castle. This shot is so the cool. Former residence, yes. That castle is also the location of your next trial. Ah. Um. I'm sorry to tell you that Victor Rookwood, evidently your descendant, is a dark wizard in league with Ranrock. My descendant. Barney. A yeah, dark that was Barney. Wizard. Barney the dinosaur. I'm afraid we've no time to waste. Despite the obstacles that clearly await you, you must get to Rookwood Castle immediately. Not only is it the location of the next trial, it is home to a source of power that would be devastating in the wrong hands. I do wish we had the luxury of time. However, I do not doubt your abilities. Find my portrait there as soon as you can. Very well, sir. I'm on my way. Best of luck. Thank you. Best of luck. No time to waste. I'll meet you at Rookwood Castle. Okay, so we do have our second trial now finally available. Quest completed back on the path, which I think will give us a reward of some sort. Um, so if we go to challenges, then... Oh, never mind. I guess it's not quite enough yet. We need to do a few more parts of these challenges in order to unlock the outfits. Uh, that's fine. Okay, so let's bring up the map. Uh, did it appear on our map yet? Because I think it should be down here, right? Isn't Rookwood Castle, like... Is this it? Did he not say Irondale? I guess I could just wait and see until it appears on our... Late mini map. Today, were we? No time to change? It scared me. I was like, why is there, like, multiple reflections over there? Wait, did he just make fun of us with the pajama look? I think he did. I legit think he just made fun of us for the pajama look. Chat. How dare he. All right, sweet. So we can teleport because we've already done a mission there with Sebastian. So we can just use the flu flame to ping over. Who lives here? Before we go into the trial, because we're probably going to get a lot of stuff while in the trial. Let's Hello, go on ahead and sell some stuff. Welcome. I am Bernard. This Diana, guy has got the is coolest mustache. Is there anything I can help you with? Uh, sure. What do you have for sale? What are you selling? What, what are you are buying? You market for today. Oh, so he sells different like furs and stuff. Okay, cool. We're just gonna sell our pleasure doing business. Useless items, ones that we're never gonna use. Just get rid of those. I mentioned you're welcome to stop by any time. Uh, you have not. Oh, wait. We should probably use our new. New flying mount. Look at this. How about some sightseeing? Here we go. And fly. Do do. Descend. And ta -da. over here, it's Professor Fig. How may we help? What's going on here? Professor Rookwood was right. Why is he whispering? Is with Victor Rookwood's lot. Chief, the disrespect. Yeah, he was very disrespectful. They're working together, all right. But it is not that's why I think he will turn alliance. out to be evil. I'm you know? sure you'll agree that we need to find a way in other than the front gate. Let's go. Okay. So, stealth? Revelio. Look at this. We could take every super stealth. Find to Ranrock. Eventually, we might get the right one. Cool. Sounds like a lot of work. Why can't I? There we go. Patrick is totalist. 
Got him. Activate the flu flame. I guess we can't go through the front here. I love the stealth mechanics as well, being a thing. As somebody who like loved playing like the Metal Gear games and Splinter Cell, definitely cool. So hold up. Let's see if we can get one of these guys distracted. Go check that out. While he's checking that. Got him. Revenue. Scan for chests and stuff. I almost feel like I'm playing Shadow of Mordor a little bit during the stealth sections. For the people that played Shadow of Mordor, you know what I'm talking about. Maybe it's just because the setting is kind of similar, you know, like fantasy and goblins and stuff. Okay, so I guess we're going to have to find some sort of a secret path. How? How did he see us? We just cast Revelio. Crushed him. That's it. Up there. Nice. Okay, so now I just need to push. Um, but, uh, we're in. Welcome to Rockwood Castle. Plan was to dig up half the I wouldn't have to dig if you could simply manage. To uh, bring me Infinity, the what's up? And the Little Italy, what's up? Dragon to retrieve the container. I spent months and there's Victor. Ministry favors tracking. You let them board the carriage. My options were limited once I knew it would be incomplete. And Ranrock. I, I didn't even realize it was him at first. Have you not acquired enough power here? I allowed you to tunnel under my family home. Allowed me? You are here only because you are descended from a keeper and may at some point inadvertently become valuable. We had an agreement. I Dang. Can share with you the power that I discovered if you locate the stores of magic that are yet to be found. So, unless you want another demonstration of my power, a power that you one day hope to wield, bring me the child. Okay. We already knew they were after you, but now we know they're digging for stores of magic. And Ranrock knows about the Keepers. Yes, I caught that too. Professor Rookwood said that you'd understand more once you complete the next trial. Well, that Let's makes sense, because concept. every trial so far has given us a brand new memory, right? And as we unlock more memories, we can understand more of the story. So, what the... Oh, come on! Okay, so there's no point of trying to go stealthy there. Get him with the stupefy. Got him. Keep moving. Dang it, why did I try to block that? I know that you can! No heal! I forgot about my health! We took three shots and we Oh yo 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 I literally took three attacks and that was enough to die. That's why it seems like you're always OP, but then moments like that, you're like, oh, okay, I got to play this, like, carefully. Oh, this day's gone on too long. 
And pay attention to the HP, most importantly. Dang it. No, back up! Hold up. I can't I can't read your message right now. Thank you. Incendio. Okay, we'll use that as almost like a shield. I Got it. <laughs> Bro, just yeeted that guy. Why did I heal? There was no need to heal there. I was okay. Okay, you know what? I think we'll use our ancient magic abilities. Wow, I couldn't even hit him from over here. Get him! Ooh, that should do a lot of damage. It did do a lot of damage. It's those archers up above. They're really tough to deal with, man. Got him. Ooh. Okay, finally. Holy. Got him. Um, What's up? Thank you for the support. Look at the hat. Which hat? Oh, the, the top hat? The Monopoly Man hat? Revelio. Ooh, we got a new... um. Trait unlocked. Mm, not the best place for an unaccompanied student. I'm just going to check over here, make sure that there's nothing else. Can't go through there. Okay, so then we just go scale the, the stairs, I guess. <gasps> to the staircase! Go. Oh. Revelio. Let's get a chest. Uh, maybe I shouldn't have climbed up. Maybe we're supposed to go back down. We shall see. Revelio. Nothing. Oh, there we go. Oh my goodness. Are you... I oh, know. We're okay. That we're about to fall down. I suppose that's the quick way down. Yep, that is the quick way down. What are these things on the walls? Revelio. Accio. Um. I think we got them all. Am I supposed to hit all three, maybe quickly? I've seen symbols like these before. I need to find all of them, then cast them quickly in succession. Is that it? Revelio. I guess the question is: Are there more than three? Um, I don't think there are more than three. One, two, three. Unless if there's one up above, I suppose, maybe. Let's go check. I didn't even think of that. There could be one up here, actually, right? Like, um... It doesn't look like it, though. 
Did I just cast the spell too slowly, maybe? Hmm. I think I might have just cast the spell too slowly. Wait. Why did that not work? Or did that work? Oh, it did work. Sweet. Got it. Here's the Rockwood Cellar. Okay, so we've gotten to Rockwood Castle and we are ready to tackle the second trial. What the heck? Okay, thank you. <laughs> that was so weird. It was just like a random like, gift bag. Like, here you go. Okay. Yeah, that doesn't look terrifying. The store of magic and the source of Ramrock's power. It looks empty. If they've taken all of it, why are they still here? Ramrock said there's more to be found, and if he's right about that, it may or may not be located here. Wherever it is, we need to find it before they do. Where is that portrait? Revelio. There's a portrait. I heard something. I was hoping that was you. Hey, hold up. I just want to quickly take a look, make sure there's nothing else. Oh, there's a chest. Bro, still have not gotten any loot that's better than what we have. We have had the same loadout as far as our clothing is concerned in terms of like the numbers or what feels like two and a half hours now. If, as you told Percival, a goblin in his vault was wielding a powerful magic, then they have somehow learned. It cannot be. And, sir, they know you were a keeper. Ranrock used the term. This makes no sense. How did... We shall discuss this later. Right now, you must complete the next trial. Just tell me where I need to go. The power you stand to wield must first be fully understood. Oh. The trials will ensure that. Power without knowledge is dangerous indeed. In the wrong hands, we will simply have to. That's a good line, Ranrock. And my power without namesake. knowledge. Very well, and vice versa. Tell me where I need to go. I no more tea. Path. Professor Fig must leave you now. Okay, Professor Fig, you stay behind. Rebellion. And we must use the ancient magic. To create a portal and head on through. Ladies, dude. I would join you if I could. I will await your arrival in the map chamber. Here's the second trial. Trial number one concluded with a pretty massive boss fight. So let's see what trial number two offers. Of course, the beginning of the trial really is very much puzzle heavy. Only in the la like latter half pivoting towards uh, combat heavy. So we'll see if trial two is any different or if it'll be the same formula. Doo -doo -doo. Oh. Ta -da. Now the problem is I need to figure out a way over and across. What did that do? Oh, 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 oh. I see this thing now. Can I push this? Uh, probably don't have to push it. Probably could just use Leviosa. Okay. And then I think if we go back through. Yep. Got it. Puzzle solved. The pajamas really enhance the game. Yeah, for sure. Uh, for chat, it does. Which, hey, if it, if it brings up the quality of the game, you know. I'm going to go out of my way and make sure that that's the way that I play the game. Go 
don't know why I would even want to go this way. Oh, there's a chest. Bro, you gotta love the, the 40 gold. Like, bro, one mandrake in this game costs 500 gold coins. So when you go through the trouble to like sidestep something and you get 40 gold, it really feels like you're being ripped off. I gotta be honest. Did that, did that reactivate again? I mean, there's just, doesn't seem like there's a taller path. Up. Unless if that does something. It does not. Hey, what's this? Dead end? And a dead end. Okay. Seems a little bit anticlimactic. Unless if. Oh, so there is stuff over there. When activating this. Okay, interesting. Intriguing. What exactly did that do? We got him, So here? No. Surely it can't be here, because then you're just gonna fall. There we go. Uh yo, Mark, thank you for the 13 months of being a Blitz Corporal saying, hey Blitz, uh got a new spidey suit. It's the symbiote. Nice. Congrats. Oh boy, gotta switch to the offense. Here we go. Get ready for a big fight. No! One shot. One shot, one opportunity. And got kicked to kick a poo. Tremendous. Tremendous. Let's try again, shall we? This time without the part where we go flying. Now that I think about it, I could have probably used the pulse to just knock them down, right? Got him. No! I believe I can fly. I believe. Bro, the pajamas are coming up poorly in the flights, man. The pajama build is not doing good work, man. We're getting flung all around. What's going on, man? I thought you guys said the pajamas were going to be the best. Got him. Strategy worked. No. Okay, third time was the charm. Third time was the charm. Hmm, that doesn't create platform. Neither does that. So I suppose we hit this. I believe I need to proceed to the left here, but how? 
Does this thing come to life or something? Was that maybe supposed to... Oh, oh, whoa, 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 whoa. No! Where did it go? Oh, no. Is it just stuck down there now? Oh, my goodness. I think it's literally stuck down there. That really sucks. Bro, where did the cube go? Bra, bra, this is awkward. Uber awkward. That's one. Does it just go right back around? It does. Okay, interesting. So doing that. I feel like I need that cube, but I don't know what to do now because the cube fell down. I to hit the mark on the far wall. That sort of thing has repositioned the archways in the past. Yes, it has, but there's a problem now. I think I might have to just um, reset. It still hasn't spawned back, bro. What am I supposed to do in that case? Because I, I, surely I need that block, right? Oh, man. If I could just make the jump. That's it. And it's all over. Your journey has ended. It's okay, though. Okay, let's see... Activate this. Spin this. Okay. So I have Vingardium Leviosa. Vingardium Leviosa. I believe I need to proceed to the left here, but how? Okay, thank goodness. Descendant. How did I destroy this before? Oh, just like that. Okay. All right. So now the question becomes... What do we use this for? Did I not even need the... I feel like a potato. I don't think I even needed that. I never even needed the block. <sighs> feel like a fool. I might not have needed the block. Maybe. We'll see. Whoa, 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 whoa. I got to walk back through to be able to fight this thing. No. Um, excuse me. How can I fight something if we can't even see it? There it is. There are two of them. Okay. I still can't. There we go. Got him. Whoo! 
Okay. Holy moly. I think if I just Whoa. I think if we just push this here. Spin this back round. Is it possible to pull one of those blocks through the archway? Can we Oh. Hmm. Oh, maybe I'm supposed to go up? I didn't even think about that. Whoa, whoa, whoa. Where did it go? Hello? What just happened? Bro, I literally, I, I just, I think we just broke the game. That's great. It's quite obvious that I'm supposed to get up there, right? Um, hmm. Maybe it's not quite as obvious as I think it is. So basically I can move it, but only when it's in like the smaller height, right? When it's the larger height, I can't move the, the brick. So then the question is, Am I supposed to try? I feel like I'm still supposed to get up there, no? No, I can't be there, right? doesn't work and I don't think I can get up was I supposed to bring that other box with or can I after pulling the block out through the archway I can place it where it can be climbed on while on the other side of the archway yeah what So walk through, grab it, pull it through, but what, how does that benefit me? I don't understand. Because once we pull it through, aren't we right back to where we were as far as the issue? Because ultimately I need a way to get up. Right? So how does that solve my problem? That's the pro that's the part that I'm like confused by. Cuz even if I try to let's say put the block here Huh? <laughs> 
I, I, I don't get it. I'm like legit confused for the very first time. Super uber confused with this one. Uh, 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 you should use Accio for what? Because I, I need to get up there, which means I have to have this be the build, but there's no, th this doesn't reach far up enough. That's the problem. Like, oh my goodness, I think I might have figured it out. Oh my goodness, I feel like such a fool. No. Wait, where did it go? Where did it go? Oh, holy moly. Well, that's quite far up. But I just needed to go back to where it was blue. Can I not just go... I guess not. Maybe if I move? Holy moly. I look legit have no idea where I'm supposed to place this. Cause I thought maybe if I could been guarding Leviosa, could I maybe, what if I put it here, then I mean, that just doesn't go far up. Right? And then for some reason, the path completely changes anyhow. Hence why I'm like completely at a loss. Freeze it at the height, at a high point. But I, I won't be able to get there if I freeze it at a, just like any random high point. You know what I mean? Because like as soon as I let go of it, it will uh, lose height, right? Like, in this scenario, if if I walk through, I lose height. If I... Hmm. Like, you see it? Watch. It's just not enough height, because then every time I take the jump, I end up falling, and... This, I don't think, is tall enough either. Unless if it does work, which I suppose I could try to go through and just pull this a tiny little bit back. Like this. Leave it there. Um, hit it with this. Go like that. Jump through. I think I might have to bring it a little bit lower height anyway. Bro, this, this is a puzzle. Place it on the edge and rotate the portal to reach the other platform. Place it on the edge. Place what on the edge? Huh? Uh, 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 
It just... So frustrating. Because, like, I can get this to twist around. But then I need a way... To get up there. And the problem is, as soon as I put this down here, right? Because theoretically, let's say if I just walk through. The problem is, I then I don't have the platform, right? So now I have the height, but I don't have the platform. Unless if I walk through, hit it, then go, then, um, Leviosa, make it float. Please tell me this will work. Holy moly, chat. Please tell me I can hit this thing from here. Freaking finally figured it out. Wow, what a puzzle. Pog to the champ. Thank you. Thank you, NTG. Thank you for the nice. Holy moly, that puzzle. Because I wasn't understanding that the blue part, like if you walk through it and go around it, you can still twirl it and it won't lose the platform up top. Because I had thought that every time that I twirl it, it would reset the platform anyhow. Uh, clearly, that was not the case. So, good to learn that. You know? Is there an enemy coming at us? Oh, yep, there is. Got him. Thank you for the XP. Bye bye. There's that sign again. This thing, I swear, oh, it looks like a dragon's like claw or something like that. Okay, that's a lot of potions. That probably means that we're about to go into a fight. Oh boy. I gotta... It's crazy because there's basically enemies in different realms. So, unless if he walks through it, I can't actually even see him until we start battling. Whoa. Yeeted him. Heal. Bro, chill. Holy moly damage. Lightning strike. See ya. Nope. Got a little ahead of myself. I have to walk through in order to be able to actually see them. Bro, how can I block an attack that I can't even see? Back through again. This time that should make this guy pop up. Oh my goodness. Got him. Here's the big one! Run up. Defender. 
Oh no! No! I have to switch to a different spell as soon as I see him casting a different colored spell. Okay, he's gonna get stunned here. I should have Protego there and stupefy. Get closer. No! Bro, I just don't have. The uh, I gotta get this down to remember where the where yellow spells are. There we go. Nice! That was big damage. Hit him with a combo wombo. What the heck is that? Bro. I overhealed. I didn't need to heal twice. I guess I have to use uh, Protego when he uses the swing. goodness first try first try I still cleared out both boss did I defeat the first boss fight the first what trial on the first try I think I did right Woo -wee. that was crazy though honestly that one was like a huge step up compared to the last one because he had the the little like flame things that would attack you as well Rebellion. Um, and then the mace, the mace attack is really tough because you have to like stop your spell animation and time it well to block. All right, here we go. We do get another memory though. Let's see what we got. I'm curious to hear of Isidore's travels. Do you come in? Is this where we see the betrayal happen? Please, have a seat. Isadora, we are all most intrigued to hear. We're ready. I've something to show you. Father... These are my colleagues from Hogwarts. Father hasn't spoken since my brother died. On my travels, I confirm that which I've always believed. That we have the power to take away pain. I think it will not work. 
Isadora. Or maybe it'll work initially, but then there will be like a... A problem. What have you done? I took his pain. This is uncharted magic, Isadora. You can only see what has been sealed in the jar, and we do not know what power that may hold. But the traces of that magic are different from what I've seen before. Thank you. Okay, we got another pensive uh, artifact. And so we're uh, ready to head back to the map chamber and uh, let them know what was seen there. So I guess they're still not uh, going to show the twist yet. Maybe Lord, after trial number three. In one piece, no less. Indeed. It is good to see you again. Professor Rookwood told me about what happened at Rookwood Castle. In light of the dire circumstances in which we find ourselves, it is most fortunate that someone so competent is following this path. Thank you, Professor. I shall keep the second artifact safe as you've advised. Good. Are you ready to move on? Um... What was the glowing strand that Isadora pulled from her father's chest? I, mean, I, I suppose it, it would be pain. You will understand more about her actions as you complete the trials. Hmm. Okay. I'm ready for whatever comes next. But does that case, mean just the pain of the order. passing of her brother, or Allow all pain in general? Former Hogwarts headmistress, Neve Fitzgerald. Hey. How do you do? I must say that I was not entirely surprised to learn that a student had been completing the trials. I've always believed Hogwarts students capable of anything they set their minds to. Thank you, Professor. It's a pleasure to meet you as well. I am certain that you are more than capable of completing my trial. However, I must first, how shall I say, prepare the location of your next trial. We trust your judgment, Professor Fitzgerald. You should know better than anyone how to manage the inconvenience of, well... A vainglorious and exasperating headmaster? Indeed I should. I shall confirm that everything is in order immediately. Okay. So, of that's, course. uh... Professor Fitzgerald needs some time to clear the way forward. Until then, you should continue to hone your magic. If you learn That's more good. about Ranrock and Victor Rookwood's activities in the meantime, please let us know. It's fascinating because we really do have almost like two. Um, okay, hold up. We uh, because we really do almost have um, like two branching paths, where essentially there's one storyline that's happening in I present know, day. Know. And then another storyline about learning about ancient magic. Of course, they will intertwine, but I suppose we'll see. We learn how he fared with the how you retrieved. Well done today, as always. We shall speak again soon. Roger that. What the heck? It's winter all of a sudden. Okay. I mean, I suppose it will probably look quite nice, right? And you got like Christmas music? Yo, let's go! It's Christmas time in Hogwarts. Or New Year's time. Ta-da! Quest complete! Charles Rockwood's Trial. Brilliant! 260 XP collected. Uh, that's wonderful. Uh, not too shabby. I uh, don't know why we don't have 
notifications of a new main quest. Maybe we're supposed to do a couple of side quests before the main quests appear. Because as you can see, it looks like the next one is actually to stop Ren Rock. And um, uh, what's his face? Rockwood. That should be interesting. Um, Grow and harvest Luxweed. Acquire all three combat plants and use them simultaneously. Okay, and then speak with Sebastian. Uh, we could meet up with Natty. Uh, da -da 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 -da. Okay, so we could help with that. Of course, we also have a bunch of other, like, smaller challenges. Whoa, this one requires level 20, so this should actually probably have a pretty good re um, reward, possibly. That's like our reward. So I wonder if we make what loot did we get? Oh, we got a new scarf. Still weaker. Um, I wonder if we could head for the room of requirement and possibly get something valuable. Finally, uh, Natty told me about your run in with the poachers. Have some news about <laughs> what the heck it's winter all of a sudden hashtag relatable definitely i think that's supposed to say about the room not loom right hello deke Professor oh never mind said you loom to tell me more about the loom ah hello what the heck is the uh, yes. loom about that deke has had a thought he <laughs> What's happening right now? Ah. Uh. It's Mr. Freeze's chamber. Yeah, the room of requirement is kind of legit. If only it was that easy to like renovate your own uh, room. You just like, bam! Suddenly you have a, an entire backyard. Deke knows how you can test the item of clothing that you enhanced in the enchanted loom and perhaps help an old friend in the process. What do you mean? A house elf named Tobbs works for his master retrieving leech juice in a cave near Hogwarts. Tobbs' master doesn't let him leave the cave and Deke knows the cave is infested with spiders. Okay, so we gotta go help out. Awful. It is. Deke hasn't heard from his friend for a while now. As the item you wove in the loom has an enchantment that might be useful, Deke thought you could test it whilst checking on Tobbs. Sure. I understand. Leave it to me, Deke. I'll find Tobbs for you. Oh, thank you. Please let Deke know what you learn about Deke's old friend. All right. I got you, dude. We'll help out. I'm curious about... What is this? Is this another area for... Whoa bro so i guess you could bring different beasts over to here if you wanted to bro this is incredible so i guess like because that previous area obviously would probably not be great for all um beasts so for example if you want um look at this Bam! And now that you get to just hang out over here. No, no, no! That's not what I meant. That was my bad. Seconds. That was my bad. I mean you no harm. That was my bad. Say, so get in the bag. The music is so peaceful too. Major W. Okay. No. Oh my goodness. I'm I'm literally trolling. I am literally tro like really? Why do I keep pressing th there triangle? I kept pressing circle. Is the room of requirement an infinite money cheat? Kind of. I, it sounds like it is to a certain extent at least. 
There we go. Okay, now we can get back to work. And go find this cave. That... Is infested apparently by spiders. So. Do, 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 do. Oh, boy. I think we could probably just teleport over there, right? Mm. Did it not say that the cave was close to... Um, Hogwarts, that doesn't seem very close. It's like a ways away. You know? Yeah. Oh, here's a pleasant surprise. What would that be? Got him. I assume the cave would be underground, right? It wouldn't be just like above ground. So it's probably down there, possibly. But that's not where the game is guiding me. I guess we'll just follow. Incendium. Uh, Brian, thank you so very much for the, uh, for the support and the kind words. Thank you, thank you, thank you. This must be Tobbs's cave. Here it is. I suppose I should head inside. It's the Spinner's Cavern. Not the Marvel character. We go in. Incendio. Revelio. Bob's, you missed your quota by three files. You know what that means. It means my little customer will be missing bottles of Seamus' shrinking solution because of your foolish mistake. You'll be given no food for a week. Also expect to punish yourself accordingly. Da, 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 da. Okay, cool. I don't know who that is. Master is awful. Oh, okay. Tobbs? Tobbs? Deke sent me. Are you in here? Should I drop down there? It seems like we'd take a lot of fall damage. God, these spiders are level 25. Incendium. These things are no joke. Hey, I got a challenge completed. Rebellion. It looks as if Tops was here some time ago. Must have headed deeper into the cave. Accio. Depulsor. Okay. Incendio. Lightning strike! Lovely move. Got him. Back here. Incendio. Do, do, do. Mm, 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 mm. That's annoying because I don't understand then how I'm supposed to. 
clear those. Because otherwise they're going to spawn spiders no matter what, right? I don't really know how you're supposed to get around that. Like, at least to minimize the damage that you take. Uh, does Blitz read chat? Yes. Did you hear about the new Hogwarts Legacy DualSense that was just announced? Uh, DualSense as in controller? If so, new. We drop down. Hmm. Rebellion. Like this thing is level 25. Oh, never mind. This thing is level 24. So I guess the level 25 was that other one. Got him. Please. I just heal just in case. That's worth. Dang, dude, that this doesn't is... sound particularly reassuring. Yeah, that's pretty sad. We go around. And we go through the creepy, creepy spider tunnel. That's filled with spiders, webs. And more. Holy moly. What is happening? Whoa. Why, hello there. This is the biggest one we've dealt with yet. Whoa. What the heck? It can just keep spawning more? Stay stationary, we're probably dead here. Okay. Thank goodness for all the items there, honestly. That legit was what kind of saved us there. Otherwise, that would have been GG well played. Stream is dying down. I don't understand what that means. What do you mean? Do -do -do. Like broken? Oh no. Oh no. I have a feeling that house elf is tops. Dude. This is big sad, seriously. Poor Tobbs. Left here alone with the spiders. Too little, too late.
Was I supposed to swim through this? I guess we can... Can I even teleport? Or no? It's weird because it looked like it was like telling us to go that way. But unless if I am miss something, I don't think there's a path through. You know? Yeah, I think we're just supposed to probably... Backtrack, I guess. Rebellion. Back up top. Break this. Deposit. Table looks familiar. The debonair like attire. The entrance to the cave. Yep. Seems you are back at the beginning of the entrance. Dang, dude. Tobes is gone. That was a big sadness. You know, sad. Gotta be honest. Ooh. Got stomped. Got him. Eight weeks is simply too many. Is that enough to level up? Nah, would have been nice though. Would have been lovely. All right, so I guess we go back to the room of requirement. What are your top three favorite Marvel Snap cards? Um, prepare some em emotions, guys. Um, I'm back from the cave, Deke. Wonderful. Uh, I don't know. It's too difficult to pick because it depends on what deck talks. you're playing, right? Like, um, if you're you playing this, something Deke, that's like very, um, it seems he was unable to avoid the spiders in the end. Oh, aggressive or it like a discard deck. Like it really pretty so much depends on whatever you're. Tubs. Um, going to go on ahead and play. That makes a huge difference. Died. We were separated. Deke always wished Tobbs had been sent to Hogwarts too. Deke feels lucky to serve such kind witches and wizards like you. Deke will miss his friend dearly and will raise a glass to him with a heavy heart. <laughs> I'm truly sorry about your friend, Deke. Thank you. You are very kind. Deke could use some time alone to think if that's all right. Emotions. It is more than all right. You do what you got to do. And we do level up from that, actually. So I guess that's kind of nice. Um... Okay, so having completed that quest, now we're ready to proceed back on the main line. World map. Let's teleport here. Uh, Legendary Clip says, what has been your favorite Lego game that you've played? Um... Do, 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 do. Probably like a Marvel superheroes. Gamora's OP. Gamora's a good card. I don't know if I would say she's OP necessarily because there's a lot of other cards that are very, like, for example, Sil Silver Surfer prior to the nerf that they just announced, like busted, like way too cheap, way too powerful. Um, 
Gamora, I don't really think is like OP. It's just a good card. High wing's fine. I'm keeping an eye on her. She's safe, Poppy, I promise. Good. Whatever the poachers are up to, I want High Wing far from it. You said you had news about the poachers and that some of it had to do with me. It did. I overheard them talking in the Hogshead and... Did you know that they have orders from Victor Rookwood to capture you on sight? <laughs> Bro, really out here in winter wearing pajamas, lol? That's what chat... It I ask chat. Somewhat. Chat's like, yo, but, yeah, but pajama moment, armor, best armor, armor. What okay? Else you heard the poachers are up to? Fair enough. But I hope you'll let me know if I can be of help, especially after what you did for Highwing. Does the name Horntail Hall mean anything to you? I'm afraid uh, not. Nope. Why? What is it? The poacher's best kept secret, apparently. The name came up twice, but they never went into detail. Hmm. I also overheard one of them bragging about all the gold they're making at the expense of innocent creatures, undoubtedly. The poachers spoke of this area, and I thought if we searched around a bit, it might give us clues as to what they're doing. If you ever meet my gran, this trip never happened. Yeah. Not to worry, Poppy. If I ever meet your gran, I shall not speak a word of this. I normally tell her everything. She might be my best friend after highwing, but she knows how I feel about the poachers. I think she worries I'll do something ill-advised. Whatever gave her that idea? <laughs> this way. Okay. Uh, leads of A. I guess we're going to go fight a bunch of poachers now. What is that? A centaur. Whoa. Tread carefully. Are they going to attack? An entire castle to roam, yet you choose to wander here. Please, we don't want any trouble. We're simply passing through. Do you take us for fools? That we do not notice more and more of your kind around here, in league with the poachers? We aren't involved with them. If anything, we want to see them stopped. I hope for your sake that is true. Our kind is swiftly losing patience with the poachers and those they It's just funny, with. he's giving the speech and we're just like walking away. Oh. Got it. Roger that. He was certainly a charmer. Mm. That could have gone worse. Centaurs aren't exactly fans of wizard kind, and the poachers aren't helping matters. But why would he think that we had anything to do with poachers? I did notice the poachers talking with a few villagers in Hogsmeade. I'm not sure why. Perhaps that's why the centaurs are suspicious. Probably. Okay. This looks like a dead end. What's up? What the heck? Whoa. I've seen a dug bog behave that violently. It seems that a lot of people are more aggressive than usual lately. I Bro. It's almost like there's something in the water. I mean, maybe. Is this their base? Because there's no poachers here. This is odd. What is it? Not entirely sure, but look around. If the poachers were here, perhaps we can find out why. Revelio. Okay. <laughs> why wouldn't they take their cages with them when they left? Pelt. Poor B. Still smoking. They can't Which means they were here recently, yeah. Still can't get better loot than what we had, which is Rebellion. ludicrous. Like, look at that. We just got it's so many there. different outfits and costumes and stuff, and none of them are uh, more powerful than what we have. It. Anything interesting? Mm. Poachers were here. All sorts of evidence. But I found something else. It's goblin made. I found goblin armor. Let's keep searching, but... Carefully. Does that mean that the goblins are attacking the poachers? I don't have a good feeling about this. Revelio. Okay. How do goblin and poacher interests align? 
Look, down there. Definitely poachers. No yep. poachers, though. So what are they doing out here? Let's take a closer look. They won't be happy to see us. Should we use disillusionment? Or perhaps a less discreet approach? Hard to say from up here. Let's get a better lay of the land. Bum, bum, bum. Here we go. I'm going in stealthy to begin with. But obviously, if things go awry, they go awry. You know what I mean? Got him. So far, so good. Hey, finally got goggles that are better than the ones that we have. Holy moly. I thought we were never going to get better loot. You're a chicken now. I think they were guarding the minister for magic himself. What is going on here? Only one way to find out. Push up. I don't think there's any other enemies here because Revelio is not popping up any enemies. So, unless if they just spawn in suddenly, should be good to go. As far as enemies are concerned, hey, got an unidentified item. And let's see what is inside the poacher tent. Did I hear chickens? You did hear what? It's a dragon! Bro, dragon battles. I knew there would be dragons again. Bro, this is like the fight between um, uh, Shang-Chi, abomination fighting, the underground like betting fights you know it's a dragon fighting ring this is Horntel hall the name makes sense now mm -hmm. no wonder the poachers were in hogsmeade so much likely taking bets and spreading <laughs> the word given how crowded it is what, <laughs> what is that let, enjoy this. let the doggo right to be disgusted with wizard kind there must be more dragons here Poachers are far too greedy to run a fighting ring with only two dragons. We should take advantage of most eyes being in the fight and look around. Hmm. But be discreet. You especially can't afford to be spotted. I just don't understand. I guess the tent is supposed to be kind of like the... Um, uh, kind of the room of requirement where it's like... Um, it's just... Uh, Someone's here. Don't know what Victor was thinking straight in a bargain with him. It's just this, like, giant um, structure that's within a small structure, right? Like, scale works weird in uh, Hogwarts, or, I mean, I guess in Harry Potter universe. The violence isn't going to get us what we want. <laughs> I say, if every last wizard is run through with a blade... Dude, I love the stealth here, man. We're just kind of breezing on through, you know, no problems. All is well for now. So better not be a trick. Hopefully it's just the one enemy here. It seems like it is. Got him. Okay, suppose we can go up. Wow, they got a hippogriff here too. Hopefully they don't make hippogriffs fight dragons. That won't end well. Okay. Whoa, that's a lot of enemies up ahead. Wait, we need to speak Did you to hear those oh. goblins. Ramrock and the poachers must be working together. Poppy, something's going on behind you. What's going on down there? Uh They must have only just captured her. She's putting up quite the fight. Not a fair one, though. 
Not with her chained up like that. Let's even hold, shall we? <laughs> hey, let's do it. Let's do it. That seems like a great idea. Let's go help out the dragon. from the looks of it we can't leave it here not with the plans they likely have for it okay why can't i run aloha mora got one A two. Boom! We got the dragon egg. Straight up Game of Thrones style over here. All right. I have the egg. Ready. The element of surprise will only buy us a few seconds. Let's make them count. Mm. There's a lot of loot here. That's it. Careful! Ram Rumble one is dragon in town. Why can't I? Oh. Oh boy. Yikes. Come on. Got him. How do we? I don't know if we're supposed to free the dragon before we defeat them. Uh oh. Here we go. Ooh. Bro! I gotta heal, I gotta heal, I gotta heal. There we go. We're good. Oh my goodness. It's just the, the pace with which they're attacking that's making it very, very difficult. You know what I forgot about? That I have this ability. Like the super dash. Oh my goodness. Okay. How? I just pull the chain or something? We're about to free the dragon, guys. I really hope it's not going to be mad at us. Because <laughs> I just thought about this. I'm like, you know... Uh, can this dragon discern who trapped it and who's rescuing it? Because um, it's not like we look that much different than the poachers, so. Okay. 
You can tell. At least it seems like it. Just woke up from a nap. Good morning, Manny. Bubble shield. What a wholesome moment. We rescued a dragon, everybody. This way. Oh, very nice. Rescued a dragon from the poachers. That's a W and the dragon egg as well. Both. That was a Hebridean black. I'm guessing the egg we have belongs to that dragon. <laughs> what was that expression? She wouldn't have left without it. What now? She didn't exactly leave us a calling card. I, I don't know. Nothing about this day was expected. Not the goblins and definitely not the fighting ring. The last thing I planned on was a dragon egg. And the poachers saw us, which cannot be good. Um. We aren't helping ourselves standing here. Let's get to safety. We can sort this out later. You're right. If there's anything the poachers are good at, it's tracking their prey. And right now we're it. Then be careful, won't you? I shall see you back at the castle. Sounds good. Quest has been completed. Fire and vice. I thought that said ice. I think I even said fire and ice before. We did it! Challenge completed. So that's another main quest done. Which makes me then obviously wonder what will be our next main quest. Ooh. After you've completed the required tasks, which I'm certain will prove useful in finishing your field guide, attend my class to learn the new spell. Oh, that it's winter now. We will discuss your progress thus far in the term. Looks cool. Look at that. Look at Hogwarts in the background. Looking pretty stylish. Dun, 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 dun. Dun. Wait, what? What the heck? I just randomly landed on this thing. And it just started spinning. Okay. I don't even know what that does. Um, alrighty, Roo. So, um, I think I'm going to call it a day there for part number three of the gameplay walkthrough. So, that means that on the next one, hopefully, I know I said it for this one that we would tackle the um, quests. Uh, sorry, the trials. And we did get one trial done. Obviously, it would have been nice to get more than that. But they are just spacing them out far more than I expected. Um, it's also, again, a huge surprise to me as far as just the sheer scale of this game. It's astounding how large the game really is. Like, there's just every time that I'm like, oh, okay, this is probably where the story is going to, like, ramp up in speed and it's like there's still just so much for us to dig through which is perfectly fine um so hopefully next time the plan is to complete the ranrock and rockwood um set of tasks i guess so that would be it looks like maybe uh what is that one two three four five six six more missions so we'll get that done and then hopefully at least one more trial ideally maybe the last two trials because there are four in total so that will be the plan with that in mind though thank you guys so very much for watching huge thank you to each and every single one of you guys who hit the thumbs up button subscribe turn on your notifications obviously special shout out to our members special special shout out to our super chatters and i will hopefully catch you guys here on the next one have an absolutely fantastic day peace out see you laters alligators bye bye